Hello, everybody. Welcome back. Welcome back to Arcane Critzers, Group 1, Session 2. We have a very exciting uh, episode planned, but before we go around, um, uh, before we start this session, we're going to go around and we'll introduce their name and characters. Thanks. We'll go around um, clockwise. The DM's always right. Hello, my name's Diego. I am playing Elena Rosa de la Sola Mir. And she is a. I got a whole ass motherfucking name of it. All right. Sorry. Oh, I just forgot. Yeah, I'm sorry. Um, Do you get to on the counter? Yeah. I am playing a human paladin. She's this, like, uh, kind of kind of skinny, average size, uh, like, light, dark skin, like, very lightly tan uh, woman who comes from a rich family, the Amir family. And, uh, yeah. Rich. I'm rich. I'm a rich girl. Yeah, we know. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, hi, I'm Dylan. I'm playing Sam Solovia. Uh, I'm a human bard, and um, he's just canonically loot too and steals all her money. Yay! It's paid. It's paid. Yep, it's capitalism. It's not scam. She's a platinum. Eat the rich. Yeah, eat the rich. Oh. Okay, so I'm Chloe. I'm going to be playing Shiloh Elka Basmohan. Uh, we all have like a <laughs> names. strand of very unique <laughs> names. I'm a sorcerer. I got burned. That's all you need to know at the moment. Hi, I'm Anthony. I'm playing Bell, the, the, uh, the Mycenid druid. It's basically a walking mushroom. Is like the best way to put it. Uh, Wears a little poncho. He always he's, he psychically talks to people in their minds and follows around this guy like a lost puppy. To a degree, you are a lost puppy. Yeah. <laughs> Literally. But we're working on it. Um, oh, I'm looking over there. Uh, um, I'm Xavier. Uh, I am playing Magnus. Insert epic last name here. Um, <laughs> That's a good last name. I am a standard human fighter. I am going to be playing from the PHB. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I'm trying to help people, I guess. Well, with that, I hear the voice. we will... Can you introduce yourself? Oh, yes, of course. <laughs> yes. Um, as you may or may not know, uh, I am Caden. Uh, I will be your DM for this evening and the narrator of Aetherka. The world that these characters will inhabit and explore over the course of their travels. And that's definitely everybody in the room. <laughs> Last but not least, we have our amazing uh, producer and art director, uh, Mari. <laughs> the person who actually runs the show. Yeah, exactly. she's absolutely. Cool. She's our boss. Um, the show wouldn't have been possible without her. So much cooler than you can. With that, we now move in to the session. Notes. Gameplay moment. If anyone remembers, last time, um, each of the characters began on their own journey, um, moving into the town of Wardstrom, uh, either having already been there or um, arriving by uh, happenstance. Uh, it was uh, before dawn of the day of the heiress Elena uh, um, de la Rosa Amir. Um, you screwed that up. Don't worry, you'll get it. I'll, I'll figure it out eventually. It's no, long. You Your you last won't. name on fandom is just Amir. I will be calling you such. Mm. I like to imagine everyone in town just calls you Amir. <laughs> uh, it was uh, the day for celebration of becoming a full-fledged adult. Um, as, as it happened, uh, during the ceremony, a strange light broke out uh, from the west, uh, as if the sun was rising from the wrong direction. The, 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 south. the <laughs> From the west. Oh. The players ran over, um, or some, some some did, discovering that the character Shiloh had been mysteriously burned by a pillar of white, glo of white glowing light. It's very funny how you don't even bother with my last name. <laughs> don't even try. Elkhag Basarin. Elkhag Basarin. Elkhag Basarin. Yay! You're a peasant. You're <laughs> every single person okay. sold you wrong. Um, not wrong anymore. Before long, the dragon showed up through a mysterious portal. She left a zombie to uh, to receive information, and after discovering that a strange figure had start sparked the portal, left. Um, the party tracked down the mysterious figure, who turned out to be someone named Mist, who wore a blindfold, and it did not reveal uh, what his intentions were, other than that he would leave this portal to the wills of these three strange beings that exist beyond the, the current plane. It was as such that uh, the rest of the party discovered a nursery rhyme in the town library that referenced something the dragon had mentioned, Shifter's Veil. Um, they, <laughs> they, they decided to, uh, to set out to Geyserfall, 
um, w believing that it might hold a key to solving the nursery's, uh, nursery rhymes clues. And with that, we open on the road to Geyser Fall. Wait. You guys have been traveling for about a, almost a week now, and you were almost there. You've encountered minor difficulties on your quest. Um, but, to start out the first session, to start out the second session, I want everyone to make a survival check. What was that? <laughs> I got a 19, but 19? my wisdom is an 8. I have so a 18. 12, 14. 18, 14. 4. 4. <laughs> Can I watch out for, like, pandas and stuff? Uh, make a perception check. Okay, 14. What do you Please get? don't roll a stuff. <laughs> 19 <laughs> minus 1. Why do you have better than me? <laughs> I told you, I got great luck. Drew. So, you know what I mean? um, so, uh, so because you are going um, a way that you have not gone before, uh, the the path is more difficult than you might have otherwise assumed. But Elena, with her extensive knowledge on the uh, geographical locations surrounding um, Wordstrom, uh, managed to lead surprisingly managed to sure. to lead the you party. Just bought a map. Um, <laughs> you bought a map. <laughs> you bought a map. I know with your how to read money. I am literate. You go. I am literate. I know how to read a map. Daddy's money. <laughs> oh, we also how, what? Please tell me you just brought like one cart. We didn't. We didn't. Yeah, no, no, no. It was just. It's just a one. It's just one cart. There's a horse, and okay. I think. What's yeah. the horse's name? It's, uh, <laughs> she probably hasn't named it. Aww. It's like fool. It's a. It's a. It's a young horse. What's the name? Can I name it? Of the horse? What's the or, name? I don't decide that. I mean, no. that that's. that's, that's I was gonna say. It's like How you guys can name, name it. the horse. Main. Because it has a name. Okay, that's Whoa. very nice. Main with an I and an E, or just wait. I don't know how to spell it. <laughs> it's an I or no I. It has two. Anyway. Oh, well, can you tell me how you spell the word name for the horse? Can you spell? Like, can you spell? What? <laughs> Never mind. Oh. <laughs> Back to Kate. <laughs> Main with an I? <laughs> it has two eyes. Yes, it does. That was above You're the table, right. but sure. Um, <laughs> actually, um, before, we arrive, uh, before we arrive in Geyser Fall, uh, there is a um, somewhat of an event that occurs um, about a day or two into your journey. Hmm. Um, after breaking out some of the su supplies that you contained in your um, commissioned wagon of, of foodstuffs and other sort of materials, um, I want everyone to, everyone who would be part of this um, to make a investigation check. Seven? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm giving you advantage because I'm... I got a plus. <laughs> <Seven>. oh! <laughs> Let's go. We're at 20 session, alright. Okay, I'm not even vulnerable. <laughs> roll, coward. Yeah, I, I didn't roll at all, guys. Fine, I, I didn't get roll. anything. I didn't. 18! Uh, so as you're making camp the first day and then pulling, pulling open this the stuff in the wagon... Um, okay, so it's so opening open up the wagon and as you start pulling out supplies, um, you notice that there, there is... Um, some of the supplies have been moved since you uh, put them in to the to wagon the, the first time. Someone has been through our stuff. Indeed, that's what it seems. No. You specifically noticed this. What do you do? Uh, excuse me, Harris. Did you, uh, did you happen to uh, move these at all? No, but it might have gotten jostled. I, I feel like it wasn't jostled. You know, maybe you should go in and check it out. What's it jostled? Yeah, the same <laughs> I, oh, I'm so sorry about that. <laughs> <laughs> the fourth I'm paying you, am I right? Uh, I push him up, and we're both, and we're both gonna look at it together. <laughs> um, Do you need any help? I make a deck save. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you could just watch from afar. Uh, you could go in front, actually. No, you're watching with me. Oh. Okay. Uh, so he's, are we like camped? Like are we just are you, we you are currently camp? making camp, and he's going to the wagon to get supplies for making camp. Yeah. As you go into um, to investigate the mood supplies, uh, you see that there is a um, there, there's a large pile where they're not should as be as if it's covering something. Uh, yeah. Um, I I don't think that was there before. You should check it out. Like poke it. Poke your little poke. I get out my spear, I turn it around, and then, uh, Maybe not, not, not blade matter? side over there, okay. blade side <laughs> over there, I'm not gonna kill this you guy. You did throw them at a guard the other time. I, I did side. almost try, the blade side bear, I did almost there. kill a guard, but I'm, I take the blunt in, and I like, and I like, poke it, and I'm like, as he does this, I'm backing up, <laughs> or she, oh, you motherfucker. <laughs> 
Gotcha. I did it again. Okay, and then I, po- I poke him, and I'm like, I, and I'm like. What's happening? Uh, 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 oh, you're so, so you better be so glad I didn't kill you. <laughs> oh, are you okay? Uh, don't don't talk to me. Um, the, the, there's there's um there's some some of the supplies that pushed away, and you see they're under like the stacks of. Uh, various foodstuffs and supplies. Uh, there is a relatively uh, young man uh, with dark hair uh, that you believe you've seen before, but you can't quite remember where. Who the hell are you? <sighs> okay. All right. Well, listen. I am pointing my blades towards you. Right. Wait. Well, just wanted to, Magnus. Before you do anything. <laughs> <laughs> I, draw, I, I, draw. I have like my I'm gonna, on the I'm gonna sling it over. <laughs> I'm gonna sling it over my shoulder. Like, can you see into the wagon? Uh, I'm gonna take a look. So as Shiloh, as you, as you look into um, the wagon, you recognize this character. Yeah. <laughs> Icarus is apparently sneaks along. Oh shit! Oh, <laughs> no, Ichabod, Apari. Oh, is, is, <laughs> is it the youngest one? I have, no. Shiloh, I'm, wait, I'm with her. I'm sorry. Ichabod! I, I know you wouldn't have let me come along, and... Uh, There's a good reason we have two horses. There's, there better be a good reason why you're here. I'm sorry, but this is... Okay, this is my younger brother. This is Ichabod. Oh, you're so, you better be so, so glad I didn't kill him. We're not going to be targeting him. He's my brother. <sighs> so we're not going to hurt him. We, he just needs some explaining, Ichabod. A tip for the I told time. you it was dangerous, and then yet you go all by... What was... Well, you know, mom and dad wouldn't have needed me. And, what? Well, I've never left the village. And you're going on this... Some adventure. All right, it sounds stupid. Yes, yes, it is stupid. Come well, on. when you phrase it like oh, that... You're going to be our trap checker. You know how dangerous it is. <laughs> in, defense, Listen, in defense of Ichabod. Don't my brother. That was a joke. Not a funny joke. Really? Yes. Oh, I thought it was very funny. <laughs> in defense of Ichabod, it is something of an adventure. However, to call, uh, unfortunately, to call you out stupid, I don't know if you want to scar like that. No, right, of course, and I just didn't know what was going on, and I don't like not going, no one's going on. No one does, Ichabod. I don't know what's going on. That doesn't mean that you have to abandon our family. Ephraim and everybody else are back at home. Oh, they don't need me. They've never even paid attention to me. Oh, come on. Don't be like that. No, it's no. true, and you know it. I'm just... I've never helped out, and, and they know that. They don't even rely on, rely on me anymore. This is the one thing I can even do that be of value. Just can, don't send me back, please. Ichabod. It would be unwise to send a child walking back a day's work through the woods. It's not woods even a child. It's a grown-ass this man. Is a, this is a man? So I don't know. He's, a, just, he's a young man, yes. It, it, whatever. Just like a year longer than me or something. We're right. stopping somewhere on our way to Grim Forge, right? Because there's another. I'm pretty Grim sure there's Forge. another place right, like yeah. right close to where Grim Forge is. If I'm Grim Forge, Geyser Falls. Geyser Geyser Falls. Sorry, Geyser Forge. I'm, t- I'm thinking Falls about Baldur Gate Three. Geyser Falls. Geyser Falls. Geyser Falls. Is it, there's a geyser. Or Imagine not. Oh, I I wrote Geyser Forge in my notes. <laughs> Uh, but yes. first of all, come out and help us make camp before we discuss yes. this. Yes, I can use the extra pair of hands. But I more do, useful than this I can one. stay. Uh, I do the thing where I cross my arms and I do the thing, like the face for like intimidation you, check. You're in trouble, but I'm not going to kick you out. Ooh, dirty twenty. Go ahead. Yeah. All right. Uh, I go ahead keeps. and whisper to him. And it's like. And that means best behavior. <laughs> uh, he doesn't say anything as, as he's, a, you know, he does his best to uh, try to be useful. But I'm like, the entire time. It is very clear he doesn't know exactly how to, how to make camp, but he's doing his best. <laughs> and uh, for next time, maybe uh, move the things back after you move them. It makes it pretty obvious when you move them and leave them there. Yeah, you know, that makes sense. I guess I didn't expect anyone to notice that. He's hardly an expert in <laughs> Do you know how to wield a weapon? Well, I, uh, and he, he, he pulls out, it looks, it's, it's um, it, it's basically a couple of sticks wrapped together and sharpened. Um, bas- no, 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 no. Where'd you get that? I, I can craft you a dagger. Card. There's Thank a lot of things want. I don't know about me. <sighs> hand axe. Yeah, hand axe? <laughs> <laughs> yes. I'm gonna give him a dagger in his other hand. hand axe. <laughs> Wait, what was this? I give him a dagger in the other hand. And, All right. Right. I want that back. Don't do anything stupid. Uh, yeah. Go chop you know some to, firewood. I was, about to, I was about to ask, do you know how to chop? Use it as firewood. I can do that. Great, him Good as firewood. Excellent. We need to. Oh. Set, no, that's no. not what I said. We'll need to I'm, set up a I fire. I thought you were referring to, to this with that. We'll discuss your fate. 
that he, he gives you like like the closest thing a village boy might consider to a salute, like what he might pick up from the guards around the around the town. Um, and then he he, he runs at swift pace, not runs, but he jogs at swift pace off to uh, suppose they chop wood and then nearby trees. Good man. I'm just I'm I don't want to be embarrassing because I know <clears throat> this is like a very big moment for him, but I'm just gonna like watch from the sideline to make sure he's not doing anything. I actually want to help him just because I know what it's like to be a new person, so I, <laughs> I want to help the dude out. Okay, sure. Can I make um, a stealth check so if a bug doesn't see me? Sure. You can trust him. I Ooh. I see the dice rolling. Now. Nine. <laughs> Nine. It, it's clear that he, he he knows you're there. Um, it's just it's hard to find a place that you can watch him and still okay. you know be obvious that like hey I'm here and not not and run away. So he, you could tell he knows you're there, but he I seems see um, almost eager to impress you. Ika, 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 what what do you plan on doing this entire trip then? What what well, what do you want? Are you still telepathic? Yes, <laughs> I've always been. <laughs> I cannot speak like actual words out my mouth. Um. So you're you're in my head, right? Um, no, I'm standing right here. Right. <laughs> okay. Can you read my thoughts? They are telling me I can't read. Apparently, which, apparently he, he looks like, over to you guys for help. <laughs> well, you can way... you can trust him. He communicates um, like this, but it's only what you send back. Uh, he can hear you talk. It's okay. like talking, but he doesn't have a mouth, so he just... I do. Is, he, is he tamed? Oh, you do. I can hear things. Oh, He's a companion of mine. Um, oh, yes. Over. I see. Right, okay. Um, okay. Yes. He's, a, he's a companion of mine with a very unique set of skills. Well, I am... Um, I have a very specific set of skills. <laughs> I am, intend to help out with whatever and make... Uh, I don't know what I can do, but hopefully I can get better at something and... <laughs> Maybe I'll be useful for once. You'll be more useful than this one. <laughs> As he looks over well, you, um, he notices nice. that you, you know, are the heiress to the, the, the <laughs> duchery of the town. <laughs> looks back at you. <laughs> we'll see about that. <laughs> Your lifestyle has already proven so. <laughs> this one cannot walk five feet. Belle, that's not nice. It is the truth. Belle, Belle, she's got a lot of money though. Doesn't mean that we say it out loud. I can walk. I can walk more than five feet. So now you keep you keep an eye on him, and we should probably discuss. I will. I I will keep. I I start reaching for my iPhone. No, 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 don't pull out your eyeball. Not like that. That was, it's, it's a metaphor. Oh, right. Yeah. You guys have to preemptively say metaphor, yada, yada. Or else he's not going to get it. It's a bit hard to do that. Someone... Don't take your eye so out. So what do you want me to do to him? Take his eye out. No, no, no. no. <laughs> Please don't do that. Stay. stay. Watch help him. him. Help watch. Him. Watch him, yes. I'll watch him. If you, could, if you could help him set up camp, that would be wonderful. That is... Okay. What I want to do. Yes. I'll help you, Phil. I'm sorry to think this might have been more than I bargained for. Yes. Oh, and I'm right. just gonna clap him on the shoulder. You have not the slightest idea. We're not gambling here. <laughs> it's only adventure. Um. <laughs> <laughs> he, he he goes in with the, the axe and you know, I'm just gonna continue class guidance on him. I'm not actually doing any. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna. Well, you are doing work. Just keep, work. Keep, you're you're just keep my hand on his leg and you're like. Uh, oh, I have a question on his leg. Take a D4 as well. He's not doing too hot, but... Uh, he gets a plus one as well, like, like the guidance. Guidance, yeah. Yeah. guidance is cut. Uh, I have a question. Yeah. So, um, <clears throat> is there a bigger city on our, on the way to um, Geyser Fall? Uh, yeah, you go a little bit out of your way and, and reach a couple other civilized places. Uh, the, 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 the cities are more spread out than they are in modern times. So they're, like, cluster. Sorry. They're not more spread out. They're less overall dense, but there's clusters of uh, little, of small towns within like days walk of each other. Okay. Um, um, isn't wasn't there supposed to be like a massive, like that massive library city? That, that was uh, that, that was, was that a farium, which is further south. In, than further, than further south. How do you guys? <clears throat> so a farium. Here's a a f a e r i u m. Can I see how my brother is doing? What is he doing right yeah. now? Uh, over the course of the whole trip. Uh yes. Um. So your your brother seems to um, Ichabod seems to become a little more comfortable uh, as the um, as the trip goes on. I, I want to spend as much time with him as possible. He he seems to warm up to your presence. It even starts to like enjoy how genuine you are with him. So but we do we do accept Ichabod in the traveling party. I accept him thoroughly. Uh, well, it would be rather dangerous to send him back alone. It to would the be woods. rather okay. I, 
I guess we <laughs> have a conversation great. that can more or less be summarized by, well, we can't send him back. So, so I there guess is I, if so we have a squire. <laughs> No, the, no. You, you really don't. You really think we're going to bring my younger brother to this? Well, I think he's a Shiloh. squire or race well, as well. Is no, that no, not a human? No, he's a human. No. Squire human. is a type of job. It, it's a profession. Eka, you're a squire. Uh, no, okay. Um, so congratulations. There, there's a so I have Thanks. an idea. We can go further down south and hit Ethereum and then drop your brother off. There may be Ethereum's in the dragon circle. You right. are moving deeper to Dragon Territory, we are, as you yes, yourself. Yes, we are moving right we are into going the Dragon's Territory. Into the Valley of the Beast. Yes, it, yeah, that, exactly, Fel, which is why I am not very comfortable with my younger brother. Who, Ichabod, who, I by the way, is any, not here without permission. Ichabod, do you swear any particular allegiance to the Duskborn, their leader, or their particular military alliance? I didn't want him to be part of all this. Do you? Well, I, I mean... I the answer henceforth is no. The answer henceforth is no. We were always taught Justin would it was our protector and that we should follow his yes, armies. Yes, but you but... don't tell them that. Right. Once you return, no, they it's could be like happy. telling the truth but leaving things out. Yes. Right. That makes sense. Yes. Yeah. <clears throat> right. Yes. Good job. You're you right. are permitted to travel with us uh, in this time, for we cannot send you back. If we do choose to send you back, you will do so without complaint. Yes. Right. And you will okay. if and when we choose to do so. For the time being, you will assist us, and we will help you. All right. As I have time. promised to protect your sister, I will promise to. I will promise my shield to you as well. That and should we tell him a little bit of what's going on? That is your prerogative, considering well, this is about you. Well, it's better than not telling him anything at all. We are going to before, a forge. Oh, before you do that, can you oh. make an insight check for me? Oh. Right. Crit 20. That 20? So that Crit is 20. going to be a... Yeah, 20. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? 20 on inside is What do you read oh, my brother? We have foiled your plans. Well, it's not... So it's we'll do a crit count. Oh, oh dude. Yeah. Yeah. So, I'll do okay. a crit count. I'll do a crit, do a crit count. Okay, well, it's not a crit because we're not... In Ichabod... Combat, this is my... Ichabod reacts visibly uh, to, to you mentioning a particular allegiance uh, to Justin or, or the dragon or... Ooh. Um, so that question meant something to him. It, do, it did mean something to him. Oh. Uh, you, you can't tell anything about... Would I know that. as his older sister... Like, older sister insight. He's never expressed any relative interest in politics yeah, or so. the, 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 the war. Would I, like, can I insight him to see why he's acting like or that? Or I'll communicate to you that to you at some okay. point during the trip, and then you can like ask him. Okay. You can ask him the hands-on-your-hips questions and just <laughs> stare him down. Yeah. Can you make a history check for me? Yes, I can. 18? Uh, 18? Uh, you remember that before the, before Wordstrom was, uh, sort of absorbed into <laughs> Justin's collection of city-states, Ichabod seemed to, um, uh, he, he disappeared for, for a while. Um, when he came back, he, that, that was when he sort of seemed to disavow the political sphere in general. Um, and would never participate in conversations about the dragon or current events or Justin's um, engagement. Yeah, I have a question. So, well, Magnus, <clears throat> do you tell us? Do you tell uh, us as well that there's something up with his like like allegiances? Mm -hmm. I would have the first thing. I'd sit on it at first, and then later, when there's a moment alone, I'd, conf I'd relay that to Shiloh, mm -hmm. and then based on what you'd tell me, then it would come up in like a little council meeting where we send them off to go cut firewood we'd be like <laughs> hey we kind of like I mean he doesn't have like a sending stone or anything on him right? I don't I, I don't have a sending stone on him how would you know that <laughs> that's a great question. oh you're right I cast detect magic <laughs> oh. okay oh does that do anything so when we're around the campfire what when we're around the campfire he casts yeah I magic. cast it and then when he comes back Oh yeah, so you so you you don't sense any magic. Cool. From from cool. from anywhere on him. And, and I was rich, so I don't nobody know. else. Nobody else has any magic stuff, right? Are you hiding any magic items? Items? You would just see that. Huh? Wait, why are you making? Oh them my face? god! Why are you making does he have magic? <laughs> I don't know. You don't know? Mm, I wouldn't. I don't think so. No. What are you? Okay, that was some crazy shit. All right, we got a we got a minor lore drop. Um, there is. A make an arcana check. Ten. No Ten. Bad. Huh? Um, um, there is magic in the vicinity um, coming from one of the members of your party, but you 
you think it might be conjuration magic, sure. you don't know where it's coming from. <laughs> okay. Second thing. Um, I want so if so, Magnus. Do Sorry, you, do we two 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 sources? Yes, two sources. Are they okay. similar? One of evocation and one and one of conjuration. Oh. Evocation. Okay, cool. Oh. So what I wanted to ask, Great. Magnus, do you do you tell us this? <laughs> um, the allegiance thing. Yeah. Oh, um, at some point. At some point, <laughs> yes. Like let's call it like like early day four. I would like whisper it to everybody. Okay. So you I would do I know here. about. Do I know about your fancy new class? Uh, does Elena know about the fancy new class? You know about the the Blood Wardens through, you know, folklore, rumor, um, especially as a, as a noble, even though the one who was shot inside, the dragon's Blood Warden forces are extremely well known and feared, especially on Justin's side of the army. Okay. Um, do I know anything, do I know, like, is there any sort of particular magic that they, that they evoke? Is like, um, the magic that they invoke is not first. necessarily tied to any one school of magic because it's not arcane. It's like the way that we that like magic users just generally do it. It's just like through a source. no, because because most yes, it is a different source than you know most sorcerers. Um, but the the, the, the magic they use hands. is not necessarily for it. it, it also, a person doesn't usually get pinged with the tech magic, right? It's if they cast it or their items would. Uh, yes, but if if someone is under the effects of magic, then oh, okay. then they you're would. saying if the, if he's under any effect, which he's not, right? Okay, so he's just part of the group, and he's just chilling there. Okay. Uh, we are absolutely like when we said watch him, you're with him all the time. Okay, also, I'm, I'm with him all the time. Him. Another Should thing, I be with his oh, wait, time mark him. another thing that I say during the travel is <clears> I, I encourage him? you to make like, a history check. Trust her. And I'm like, giving you a little bit more. Not one. Okay. If you're uh, you have company, no clue. No clue. Cool. Like, then uh, in fact, you're you're not entirely okay. sure what Blood Warden is. You know it's some something fearsome. Yeah. But that's all you've heard. Yeah. Damn. Fuck that that one. Uh, you roast that race half the shit you just said. Okay. Sure. Then I'll follow. Xavier, add another mark on me. Okay. Okay. I am so bad. So one, two, three, four, and maybe a five. Is there any, is there anything else you guys want to do at, while stopping at the various towns um, along the way to Geyser Fall? Uh, um, it's a dance. Uh, I I like As, go up, I go up to my brother and I do the thing where I like grab his cheek and I like pull it uh, too far. I do that too. Or he was thinking. <laughs> on Shadow? No, on Nika as well. You're trying I'm, to reach I'm, I'm copying you. You have, I'm to, just, you have to reach. Oh, up you don't to have. Do it. <laughs> I, I'm reaching up like on my you toes. Want to and, like, one more intimidation check. Can you I I'll help you with it. You get advantage. I'm four feet tall. Twelve. Twelve. Four foot six. Ah. Not one. Ha. <laughs> <laughs> the dice are against you. It. They always are. Always been We're stubborn since you were little. It, he. He Kaden, honestly. I hate his boy. He. He shoves you away. Everyone loves you. Okay. I. I don't know. I sit around at home. I. Go out in the fields and I mess around with my friends, and you're always so helpful. And I maybe that's why, but I never just find the chance to do the things you do. I thought maybe this one time, if it's for something grander, then I'd be part of that journey. And maybe when I get home, and everyone will, I won't think I'm a hero. Ichabod. It sounds stu- I know it sounds stupid, but I'm trying for once. Ichabod. Do you really think that? I and our family don't love you. Sometimes it seems that way. Ichabod. I know, I'm sorry. It's, I know it's, it's stupid. I just... We love you. We love you with all our heart. It doesn't matter if you're not, if, it doesn't matter if you don't feel special or helpful or whatever you feel right now. It doesn't matter, you're my brother, and that's not gonna change. I know, I know how you feel, I know that you're angry and frustrated, and I understand, and I'm sorry that I didn't help you with those feelings. But what you did was reckless and dangerous, and I'd rather have you here than a dead brother in the realm of the dragon, okay? And what you did, going in the woods, been your face burned off? That wasn't reckless. I didn't ask for my face to be burned, Ichabod. No one asks for their face to be burned. (laughs) 
next time I'll... I'll ask you to, before I do something stupid. Yeah, and you think I'm going to get a yes out of it? Okay. Maybe one day it'll pay off. That's, why I didn't ask. That's all I'm saying. Maybe, one, maybe sometimes you have to do something stupid. Okay. <clears throat> I know you're, you're a grown-up. You're not that much younger than me. So I know there's some trust I need to put into you that I know what I should know or I should at least trust you in what you're doing. You, you're in charge of yourself. I don't want to, as frustrated as I am right now with the recklessness that you're displaying, I don't want to take control of your life and throw you back into the door like we were children again, okay? So. Yeah. Okay. Sounds good. I'll see you tomorrow at the lodge. Yeah. See you soon. When you walk away, you pass by us in the midst of, um... I'm rolling to see you fuckers. <laughs> I mean, do I get that? <laughs> you too. Anyway, no. No, as as you walk away, you pass us playing Being Dragon's Chess, stuff. and you see Magnus and Elena shaking hands as Elena has won the game. Oh, um, I and uh, Magnus is going to look up and go, so, what did he say? Well, it was just me and Lee <clears throat> telling him off, I'm going to be honest. That... Silly boy. He what? doesn't know how much I love him. Silly boy? Isn't he not basically your age? Yeah, but that is not a boy. That's true. He is a li- He's only like 18 months younger than I am. Then why do you act so older than him? Well, I have a lot of younger siblings, so to me they all just feel younger regardless of much younger. Do you, she's far more mature. Do you not think that maybe you treating him as those one of those younger children makes him want to prove himself more? Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. I have not thought of that. Do you I don't know, I've seen him, I, I don't know, he's my younger brother, so I guess I've only seen him as my younger brother, that little. Maybe as, do you want one of us to talk, talk to him or would you rather we let him cool off? I could speak to him if you wish. No, I'm I, I love this people, Ika. <laughs> Why do you keep calling him Ika? Well, he gave me a name and... <laughs> Nicknames. Oh, I... Oh. I long you is that not what show. people do when they get close? They, it is. They no, shorten it is, the it name is, in a fun way? It is. I, I, just, I just didn't know it was a nickname. Well, because technically I am fellow, right? Yes, you are. So... Oh my fellow. god. <laughs> I am, oh a, I am a fellow, but now I am a fell, so okay, it's okay. like the same difference. Okay, well, I, did, I didn't you... know that, so thank you for telling me. That, that's a very lovely name to give to my brother, thank you. Do you wish me to speak to In the moment, I, I did... I was a little bit too harsh on him, so... I could try to Maybe dull just, the edge. Yeah. What does he seem to what? be doing um, after being chess? So he has his, he has his um his hand axe in one hand and a club club the other, and he's he's going at um like a, there's a tree there. Uh, he seems to be like attacking it with both, like just as if he's as if there's an enemy there you can't see. Does he have any form or no? No, nineteen. Barely any. Sorry, it, you, it, it's almost evident that he's been doing this ever since he's left. Uh, but uh, the, the 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 his form is quite abysmal. So he's been building up strength for that form, right? So after after watching for some time and just waiting to see if he um, notices me, like the moment that he takes a pause, I'm just gonna go. Talk. <laughs> a one in five. So oh no. yeah. Oh my sweet dearie. I go up. I go up behind him. I'm just like, well, I could use some work. And I'm like, I chip. I chop the tree in the background with five swings. <laughs> Five swings? <laughs> he's just so, five swings and he's like over here turning up some Short tree, from. I'm sure. Um, <sighs> listen, with this, you're going to want to hit like that. And I'm going to demonstrate with the, I have two hand axes. I'm going to demonstrate with the other one and I'm going to, for just quickly, show him a few motions and like places where he can hit. And he's like, this is better to strike because you can hit them from here rather than just swinging wildly. Okay. Oh, and all the motion comes from your legs. Right. It's all my hips. You have to fully move forward. Alright. It takes a swing. Uh, 19. Whoa! Uh, so, it was slowly, he, he moves from, <laughs> <laughs> from, from swinging wildly, he makes a controlled sweep slowly right into the, the chip where you're, you're actually left. Better. Huh. That doesn't feel that bad. 
after a few minutes of giving him a few pointers, but not mm-hmm. too long. Um, damn, I was going to say something, now I'm forgetting. Oh, right. I'm going to um, sit down, not on a tree that I just magically chopped down. <laughs> um, what? Why did you just put me on the counter? Because you did. Oh, I didn't even... <laughs> <laughs> Darn out. language! Um, right. Um, I'm going to say, let me guess. Left home, looking for adventure, wanting to live up to the stories? I don't know. Never been one one much for stories either. Just want to be useful. Sounds like someone I know. Listen, it is quite an adventure. Things will happen that you can tell tales about or enjoy and think about, and yes, it does get your heart racing, but there might come a time where you leave and then you realize you can't go back. If you wait too long, you're... Maybe your home won't be there anymore, or maybe the people that you know won't be the same. Maybe you won't be welcome. There is a life of adventure from it, but you may become a whole different person in the process. Thank you. I... You have a lot to learn. Yeah. As does your sister. Yes, does. I know. Your sister has the slight advantage of... Uh, being in great and exceptional danger, unfortunately. Oh, I know it. But, maybe you'll pick up a thing or two, and then you can return home and, well, you can take up quite the position as, well, I'm sure you can do great work nearby. Start, start local first. Word of advice. Well, those are trying to save the world, right? Save the world, or perhaps chase a nursery rhyme. I have my doubts myself. Usually it's more, you find a relic of some sort, it's a little bit dusty, put it on a shelf somewhere, give it to someone who knows what to do, and that's the end of it. I suppose I can live with that. Well, take heart. I'm going to cut him on the shoulder. He nods once to you, then goes back and starts trying to for the, the axe form you showed him. And then right before I leave, I'm just going like, to unexpectedly turn around and I'm going to stare him dead in the eyes and just like, nothing else that you have to tell me? Intimidation with advantage. Hold on. <laughs> Wait, I just realized I have to actually succeed the check before you can actually congratulate me for it. Um, that's gonna be a fifteen. Hold on, I'm gonna I'm gonna show this to the camera. That's no one else look. <laughs> show it to the camera, guys. Look, the thing's reflective. Oh, it's right. too small. I can't see it. All right, what'd you get? Uh, fifteen total. Fifteen total. Not at all. Just here to be a hero, I suppose. Less hero and more wanderer. What'd you say? Less hero and more wanderer. At least that's what that's what I am. And then I will leave him alone. All it's right. fine, guys. <laughs> yeah, it's fine. Okay. He's fine. It's fine. Oh goody! My my little brother who has not had a day outside the village is going to do enormous wonderful hero things. Of course he will. Woohoo! Okay, so um, he's, on, he's on our side, guys. He's with us. He's on our side. It, it is um, I, 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 after after a while, the the the, uh, the hills of of, um, the, the, of the plain land start to get higher and steeper. The landscape is changing, become more rocky, more mountainous. Until eventually, uh, eventually, uh, you reach, um, and I'm gonna go on the um, the wiki in order to pull up the map. For a quick little we're refresher, maps again. Um, we're just to range. check where the mountain ranges are. I'm under the assumption that Aetherka, ge- geography-wise, is like a soup in Caden's mind, and there's a bunch of <laughs> there's a bunch of like cities and stuff that are relative to each other, but they have no fixed location. It's like, ah, oh, yes, this city, which is south of that city, which is north of the other city, and we know because the other one's there. <laughs> is a ba- at the towards the tail uh, was called the Tail of Bahamut Spine. Uh, which is a mountain range that stretches from westernmost coast down to the lake near the uh, southeastern corner. Western, not eastern? From the west to down to the... Sorry, for you guys. Western down to the... Uh, uh, down near a lake near the southern easternmost corner of the continent. Okay. East coast. I'm wearing jersey now. That was a joke. <laughs> <laughs> but there was no D&D the jersey, jersey Shore. shore. <laughs> near the tip of this mountain, there's a relatively... The tip of this mountain range there's a relatively uh, rocky, low-cut mountain um, that is called 
Geyser Fall Peak. Um, the, there is a long river that flows down, branches off into multiple points, and from the top of the mountain, every, every so often, you hear a... The grounds are shaking a little bit, and then... A geyser of water. You can just barely see the tip of the mountain crashing down into a, a, a lake that flows and then sort of feeds the river that flows down the mountain. With well, my friendly. pure anxiety... You can drink this water. I'm I going to you. cast you Bless. Can't, you can't drink that water. <laughs> You're casting Bless? I'm going to cast Bless. Right it's... now? I can also oh, cast Bless. Oh, it lasts bless. how many hours? It lasts... Uh, oh, never mind. It's, I thought it was an hour. It's a concentration to one minute. Forget what <laughs> no, <laughs> don't cast that. No. Don't cast I bless. do. No, oh, wait, no. I remember. You can't do that. I have a question for you. Hot. How are you feeling about this new... Power source within you that seems to want to come out through your hands. That's a great question. I've had a lot of sleep this night. <laughs> so, uh, oh no. I, at the moment, I've been kind of suppressing these feelings because uh, of the sudden intrusion of my younger brother, and I automatically just kind of like pure instinct just kind of shift to him, and my worries are mainly about him at the moment, mm-hmm. as to like not think about the powers that I have. Sure. Lucky for you, you've had an emotional support animal following you for a while. That's not an animal. That was a fellow. No, but an emotional a... support fellow. <laughs> he is emotional support. Are we standing like at the cave? Like we're... Uh, no, we're so standing at that, toward, it towards the base of the mountain as you're approaching <clears throat> this. Uh, there is there is small openings scattered up it uh, through there, purportedly any of which would lead you to the city of Geyserfall that's built in on into the cave network of this of this mountain. Then by seeing like this mountain range, Bell is like basically like shaking and just grips onto like Magnus's arm and just does not let go. I can still like being over. <laughs> Are you okay, Phil? Uh, my huh. You're lying. Oh, oh I am. <laughs> no! <laughs> <laughs> Please just add disadvantage all deception. <laughs> I, I'm just not gonna use deception You already have a minus one. I'm just not using deception. Oh, I don't want... is, it, is it scary for you? I don't have good memories. Okay. Of that. Would holding my hand make you feel better? Or holding on to Magnus make you feel better? I like holding on to Magnus. Okay, then you do that. <laughs> With the arm that's not being gripped, I uh, draw my sword to additional moral support, and I'm like, oh, I've got it. You, you have. Me. We've come this far. <laughs> so you have. So, you make your way up to the. Um, up to the cave entrance. It's rocky, so it's... <laughs> yeah. After months of travel, we return um, to the site of our French <laughs> Yeah, this is where we're going. Oh, that's so nice. Uh, in fact, the, the, the car is... Uh, it, 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 there's multiple times we have to, like, you know, all work together to get it over a particularly rocky portion. The wheel goes down a hill and we have to chase after it. <laughs> no! <laughs> or the cell cell, of course. No! <laughs> okay. But okay. eventually you reach okay. a sort of level off section of the mountain that seems like it was actually built for this purpose. Uh, it is m- it's mostly gravel, uh, with, it, but it's flat and it goes up, like, crisscrossing and um, switchbacks up to this uh, southernmost base of the, of the mountain cave entrance. The entrance looks to be unguarded. There are, there are no um, Dorgar. There are no Durgar in sight, but Fel and Magnus have informed you of the large population of Durgar that live inside the caves. So, do you go in? Before we go in, enjoy the sunlight. <laughs> and I've heard, do we intend to keep our intentions some sort of a secret? Are we going to make it known that we are looking for Shifter's Veil? Should we be encountered by anybody here? We are in the midst of the Dragon's Terror. I, mean, I well, think it would be best. We to are be going quiet. somewhere where I believe the dragon doesn't reach. I, we I thought going... we were going into the dragon's territory. No, we are in the dragon's territory. Yeah, but we're at the top of the cave. What I'm saying is, we are going very, very far down. Geyserfall oh. has historically been neutral in conflict so far, but it is known the dragon has made multiple efforts to recruit the Durgar of uh, the very vari- various regions and mountains nearby to his cause. Yeah. And we have to go down to the Underdark, or is it higher? Do we it is, is the, it's in the, the city exists in multiple, on multiple levels, yes. but if you want to go to the Forge, it's the deepest part of the mountain. I have a uh, So I think it is best if we keep our actions, our reasons for doing, for being here, as soon as possible. possible. 14? I, and additionally, uh, 14. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. what kind of exports does... What kind of exports does Geyserfall have, and what kind of imports does Geyserfall need? 
History check. What for are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Mm, I can't curse in Spanish. Uh, 14. So you know that um, Geyserfall does largely deal with the import of metal and fuel and exports uh, various um, tools and weapons. Uh, he's a, a large weapons manufacturer, but will also... Um, uh, it, it is also you know, built for constructing all sorts of construction material and other tools. It is a general purpose exporter of mass tools and goods. Tools and goods. Um, any... Th- uh... However, they, they don't have any uh, farms, so they do import all their food. Uh, isn't our... Isn't Worm... Isn't Wormstrom a big... I don't remember Wormstrom's a big farming place. It, it was more of a, a trading hub, more so a, trading it, a hub. lot of its income came from taxes from right. commerce. Which comes to so, thousand or like tens of thousands? Oh, it's three thousand. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. And if we are asked, um, and not, <laughs> we're not going to say we're looking for ship as well, we have come for the, what we have heard to be the best forge on this side of the spine, and we are here to ascertain that for ourselves. This side of the spine. I love that. Sorry, continue. <laughs> yeah, that is a, yeah, pretty My sword thing. itself was uh, dwarven forged, and I would. Not, <laughs> I just. Dwarven forged, never mind. Dwarven forged, uh, that's pretty my sword my, itself was dwarven forged, and I would like to see the work of the Dukra. Okay. Where is my thing silent? Uh, your brother is at the moment. Um, he just gone. <laughs> no, he, he's, like, he's walking along with you. He seems, he's got a knife. He seems two per ten. <laughs> he seems very um, sort of like kind of taken aback by the size of, of the mountain range. Heaven, you, you guys Disgusting. have lived in a fairly like hilly, plainy land. Yeah. So looking up at this mountain range before him with the caves, he's, he seems a little anxious, but resolute. I don't oh, I suppose. Don't have perception anymore. I suppose that you, Let's you, go. and, well, you, you you and him would be a little bit like still right now. mountains. Oh, yes, yeah, we're not in yet. We've but. never really seen mountains growing up. We lived in uh, Central Florida. I thought we my house was small. You won't be seeing the mountains at all. <laughs> going in it. Right. Well, their house is remarkably lower than yours. Take a stay by my side. If you're going there. in, then you're seeing the mountains the whole time. That, that I can do. Oh, oh, sure. Glad you can yeah. finally listen to me. Anything, yes. Yeah. Anything that smart. works from... Bob, any where smart. are you from? Any any possible leverage mm-hmm. I can City. have when it comes to setting up a training base for orange from here? No. Or would worms from already have one? Um, Insert city is so cool. Or like a direct, like a direct, like instead of like indirect, like oh here, 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 it's okay. more direct. Sure, there, there's possibility for that. The Durga are, are, are rather isolationist, except for those the missions that they've been setting out for years and years. Mm-hmm. So they're not relatively too keen on starting new contracts. But if you've just one, depending on how persuasive you are, you might just be able to land one. Okay. Okay. Do you have the authority to negotiate on the behalf of your father? Now I do. <laughs> <laughs> Very well, Lady Elena. So, the cave yawns before you. The light oh, from outside so disappearing in, in, in the darkness. Oh, there yes. are small um, ch- chittering noises coming from deep inside the cave, as if from small rodents or bats. Mm. But other than that, the stone looks um, silent and empty. Save for the occasional rumbling from the geyser high above. We have a bit of a long travel and we prefer not to scare any anxious people ahead of us. Would you demonstrate your talents to us during this journey? Well, what kind of easy do you want? I, I am not the bard. I can announce myself, I can kind of keep it calm. Just to accompany us as we travel. Alright, uh, I'm gonna take out my lute and I'm just gonna start strumming something that kind of matches the pace that we're walking at. Okay. <laughs> but right. also, I also make it like not an alarming kind of sound, so. He's gonna also, you'll be doing perception because he's got dark vision. Okay. Yeah. Can. Do okay. I cast guidance on myself? Oh, I I can do. Yes, we need. Yes. <laughs> that is you, the thing I can do? If you do it before you plan the check, but for perception, it's weird because it. It's, oh, like, it's like. You're doing yeah. you're doing this check for like a full hour and you cast guidance roll, so for a minute. You have dark vision? vision? I'm an ASMR. Oh. Right. You you became an ASMR. <laughs> right. Oh. Well, you don't oh, know wait. that either. <laughs> Which is great. Whoa. Figure it out. Inspiration. 
Was that the <laughs> Yes, absolutely. Yo, um, so, so, so I guess you roll as well. So, so a, a, a few strokes of music later, you feel a little bit invigorated. You Human. puff out your spores, reabsorb them uh, in order to you know, give yourself a burst of confidence, and you stride forward into the dark that you know so well. What perception for doing this? Oh, oh no! Oh no! <laughs> That's a two, a one, a one. So that's a, 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 a full, that's a nine. Oh, that's the worst roll. That's the worst roll. I'm just nervous, I guess. That beats wow. you. Actually, it doesn't beat you. You're still there. Oh my god. Also, you're also part of the human gang. Oh, yep. Human gang. As always. Oh my god. That is the worst roll. I got two, a 14. One, one. Okay, 14. Yeah, it could have it been a one, one, and a one. Uh, so you notice you got a one, one, one. So you are are honestly so relieved to be back into this into, into this darkness that you're you're not really paying attention to the actual surroundings. All you're kind of reveling in your vision, but not seeing much. It's not as dark as I thought it would be. I wonder why. <laughs> Wait, can you see? Yes, it's quite bright actually. It's like I I can't. What, what, what are you seeing? I assure you, it is not. Well, I see bright. the interior. What do I see, Kaden? <laughs> uh, what you see uh, is. The, the the cave o- opens up as Excellent. you get deeper. I'm putting in. a torch. <laughs> <laughs> the uh, and as the light shines, the rest of you begin to see this too. The the cave before you extends and gets wider and wider. It, it slopes down to, in, into the ground, uh, but some ways in there is a portion of the ground that seems to have built in in a big metal um, like. Arch. Vaguely mechanical. It's an oh. arch that goes in a full circle around the around the entire cave floor, walls, and ceiling. Wow. Metal. Uh, uh, but past that, it's, just a, it's a thin selection of material components, and then it's back to stone. Technology. What yeah. do you do? Science. Yes, science. <laughs> yeah, science. Whoa, what is this? I'm gonna touch it. Make a... Ooh. Make a nature check. Nine. Nine. DM, just, DM discretion. Uh, on a nine, uh, the it's mechanical of some sort, but doesn't appear to be active or it, it's there's no there's no obvious mechanism of activation. At I'm moment. so fascinated I, by it, so I'm just like, Whoa. can I try and see what she's looking at? Uh, yeah, sure. As, as you bring the flickering torch closer, the the orange light illuminates, shines shining off of this, these metal components and looks to be what we would know as pistons and cylinders. Mm. Uh, that they'll stretch up and around this this ring. I have no idea. Indiana Jones style. Named. Exactly. Yeah. No predator. What are these unnamed inventions? So, so totally what do you do? Hmm. Do we hit some sort of end, or is this just? Outward? No, it's just a continued tunnel. But th- this ring is it's, there's a small output of uh, sorry, a small lip of metal components that ring this the cave right here. No obvious activation, right? Right. I suggest we keep going. No reason to stop now. I prefer not to collapse the mechanism that is supporting the ceiling above us, if that is indeed what it is. We don't have to touch it. Can I look at the way that it works and see if it's like just a giant wall? Make a nature check. Uh, 21. 21. Man, imagine not having your paper character. You, you can see <laughs> rolled up into, into it's a small, it's a small, it to be air powered um, activation roll around the entire edge is a big uh, net. But then it's just rolled up and it looks to be like sent to shoot forward uh, upon some activation. It doesn't look to be a door or anything that would slam down, but it is it's very clearly primed and loaded. This is like a trap. What if I like picked up a rock and like threw it in the direction? I was also Wait, gonna, I, I was also that? gonna throw Where's something, the- yeah. You had to use a different entrance. You you came from the you came from the. the it, guys, because I followed the river up. Right, so so you not, you might come through the river entrance, which is different from the one that you. Oh, yeah, we're, you were at. we're like at the top rather than <laughs> near the bottom. Oh okay. Right. So because I I do? sure as hell did not climb um, up that mountain. Yeah, none of us are rogues. No. Um, not. Okay. Let's walk into the tra- <laughs> Um Do I see any like? Rocks or like anything I could pick up and toss. Sure, there's, there's loose gravel and various like big chunks of, of stone around. I can take a. <laughs> I go step back and. Poof. As soon as you as it passes through, you hear a. <laughs> and the net snaps around and brings the rock back. 
it um the net seems to, like cut off as soon as it it, it is passed, and the the rock it thuds to a halt, surrounded by um, a net mesh. Okay, it's just oh. net, no like just. In it. There, there's also a light blinking in the far end of the tunnel, deep in the distance. Okay. Well, I think we warned them. Uh, we should have done that. I'm really sorry. N- don't, don't worry. If about it, it wasn't the rock, it would have been us. So I would like to thank you for doing such. Um, should we? Is it? Wait. This is, okay. Uh, sorry. Why? Uh, dice clinky noises. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I. Yeah. I. Shall do. we wait here for? As guests. How do we proceed? Um, can does it look like? And on, on that note, does it look like it was like put in? Like, if, does it look like it's built into the wall? Like, it took a long time to do this, or did it look like it was like hammered in hastily? No, this is this is a this was is this is an old, not necessarily old, but it is it has been here for a long a long enough to be have to be a careful construction. I believe it might be best to stay as friends, but. Not cross into the, uh, the throne of rock. <laughs> another trap. Another another rock. Uh, s- s- snapped into it and then mesh met and rolled. Yeah. To the ground. Trying to fight another rock. <laughs> okay. Uh, the, the light is is blinking stronger now. Okay. It's best not to waste resources. Just rocks. Well. No. Their resources. Ah, right. Uh, it is. We have about own. a minute since you first threw the first rock. Do you want to keep waiting? Yeah, we have our own. Are you still playing? Yeah, I'm still playing. And we have our own torch. I sit up, sit down, press cross. Bang, 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 Can everyone with dark vision make a perception check? Oh boy, please the chicken. Perception. It's the big <laughs> Eight. Fifteen. Fifteen. Goes really from a two to a thirty. So I think Fell, you're finally like, ah, oh, darkness again. Mm-hmm. Uh, you're, 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 uh, but you're, you're not really paying attention to the. The two surroundings. Why are you staring at a wall? Sh- Shiloh. <laughs> <laughs> it's a wall. You're too busy reflecting. Shiloh, you see, uh, you hear the uh, dozens of tiny feet pattering. Footsteps. D- down from the where the where the light is coming out. Ichabod, get behind me. Uh, okay. I'm stop playing. Can you see me? Uh, the music <laughs> cut, cuts off with with you slap the strings. And I'm gonna like put, close. I'm gonna like. Draw a dagger behind my back and get ready to throw it. Okay. Shield up, sword, shield. Yes, at this point, everyone can ready action. My I, ready action is dodge. Yeah, take my halberd yeah. and I set it in the ready stance, which is actually blade pointed down. Oh. Same with spears. You're just supposed to have it like this. Because if you have it like this, you can hit someone behind you. Interesting. Can I I'm sure I've seen Caliban that looks like that. You can? Like this? As, so. So you, you're. So the tight sparks. Oh, what am I doing? It can bob to the back. What the fuck? Right. No. Okay. <laughs> but. Yeah, right. Better not with that. Uh, eventually, coming to the light, uh, carrying what looks to be a a, a, a blinking, uh, shining glass sphere, is a small creature with large ears, uh, slightly green grayish skin, uh, and a protruding nose over which he wears a a makeshift metal helmet. <laughs> Who goes there? Oh, it's a goblin. Yes. Yes, I, I, I'm Goobaloos. 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 It's a J sound, actually. Every down gets it wrong. No, no, no. Who are you and why are you here? We seek uh, the forge underneath of this mountain. Oh, you come to the forge? No, no, no. People don't come to the forge anymore. Well, we have heard much about it and we are very excited. But tourists. T- tourists? Have you signed the <laughs> waiver? What? Well, what? that's what we're here for. We couldn't get in contact with anybody. <laughs> ah, this again! All right, follow me. <laughs> he turns the planks down, um, d- down, down the hall. Uh, as you pass a, a sort of change in the opening of the, well, you see that there are about uh, twelve other goblins who are also in, in various makeshift armor that that are waiting as if waiting for a call to attack any intruders. Oh, on the outside of the ring? Uh, no. So oh. the, the the cable is that and it opens up a little bit. Oh. And then behind this lip. That there were about twelve goblins. <laughs> Pretty funny. Yeah. Uh, I put my hand on the, As you guys are moving, the goblins fall in the, <laughs> fall in the line behind you. Uh, there's a few like like whispers ch- chattering. They all have these very high pitched uh, voices that, um, but they seem to take themselves very seriously. Yeah. It's good uh, that they take themselves very seriously. Thank you for guiding <laughs> us. 
Yes, of course. Every time people come in, they're saying, oh, we want to see the forge. We want our weapons. We want our trades. But, yeah, was, but they can't fill out the paperwork. When was the last time somebody came here? No, not too long ago. Maybe about 15 years. Oh, that's... Could have been longer than that. I don't know. No, that's a bit longer than 15 years. Yeah, Coven's lived for to be about... Um, I, if, well, given the average um, high fatality rate of goblins, uh, it's closer to about 40 in fact, the So, lifespan. let's say a natural lifespan. A, nice, a natural lifespan of about 50, 60. Oh, wow. Adventure less lifespan. Or is it all fuzzy memory? I am mm. the one cause of that. So he was of red. Of That's what I remember. He was red? He was red, yes. Oh, interesting. A lot of metal men with him. Very strange. Very strange. Very strange metal indeed. Metal men? Have you heard anything about metal men? Uh, were, they oh, men, were they men in metal, or were they fully... Ah, hard to say, hard to say. There were, oh, four or five. Oh. And they all concealed the faces with metal. Very strange. That is very strange. Yes, yes. What was the red person like? Oh, it's been so long now, I barely remember. That was more than half our life. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> very okay. aware. Please how, get by me, you know? How old are you? That's a bit rude. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest, I can't rightly remember. But, you know, it, it, you're passing, I'm passing, but my children will carry on my legacy, so yeah, I don't really care much. <laughs> Pointing down along the tunnel. Uh, eventually, the, the, the tunnel branches out a few times, but he, he takes a, a right turn and then a left. Um, and then down a carved set of stairs and into an op a more open chamber um, where there seems to be a, a couple of. Uh, there's a couple of gray-skinned, short, uh, highly muscular men with, with thick, dark beards. Um, and they, they turn to look at you as, as you walk in. Uh, they, they all, you know, various, like, <clears throat> patchwork, thick clothes, leathers and furs. Um, uh, they're all very, rather haggard, and they have, you know, sunken skin, but looking very fearsome and very hostile. Do you say anything? Uh, or, or do you let um, Gooblues uh, introduce you? I'm gonna, I want to. I want to see what he says as an introduction. We got more visitors. <laughs> hello. More visitors. Yes, hello. Oh, that's a surprise. We haven't seen anyone in. Oh, it's been a while. Fifteen years. Did ago. they fill out the paperwork? No, as always, they're here to see the fort. Say they're tourists. Tourists, eh? All your names. If we could start with uh, the most esteemed member of our group. My name is Ella Rosa de la Sola Mir. Ella Rosa de la Sola Mir. Gotcha. Yes. <laughs> I, yeah, you have my, the name on my character sheet. And we are here just traveling. Tourists. Well, and this is... Hi, I'm Sam. I'm, I'm a personal bard. Uh, one of the well, one of the door in the back who looks, who, who looks a little like older, he is not gray in his beard. Oh, uh, bored, you say? Yeah, what well, news you? Uh, what it cost to keep you down here for a while? Who we'll use the entertainment? As long as we're right. as long as we're staying. Uh, I don't, I don't particularly want to stay in. Well, this area, I got places to be, you know. Oh, uh, they are from George. He is part of this tourist group, and I'm sure they've been wanting to move along soon enough. His name is George. <laughs> uh, no, George. Oh, George. Like George. <laughs> no, George. J O R Z. But uh, I'm sure I can provide some entertainment while I'm here. Oh, that's, that'll be right, guys. Nice. We'd right appreciate that. I'm going to start playing some rock music. <laughs> <laughs> On a loot, of course. Yeah, I promise check, please. Oh, shit. Twelve. Twelve. Four. <laughs> <laughs> Twelve. 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 Um, the, the sort of magnitude situation is a little intimidating to you at the moment, especially because there's people you've never met before. You don't know what their, what their preferences are. It's kind of hard to, to do the normal music you usually play, the quality. But the um, but the echoing off the, of the chamber uh, walls is... Um, it, it actually is more aesthetically pleasing than you might imagine at, at first, so it sort of makes up for your shaky um, hands. Perhaps there is some place to gather and some place to stay, or perhaps it would be easier to curate an audience for our bard here, and perhaps we could rest as our travel here has been quite long and truthfully wary. You come seeking business or pleasure? 
Uh, a mixture of both. If we wish to see your forge and perhaps examine your items, I personally find that pleasurable, but for you it might be a matter of call. Uh, everyone wants to see the forge. Well, what else uh, does Geyserfall have to offer? If it, You say that as if there is something else that's worth seeing. <laughs> we have a grand armory. Oh. Oh, of course we could. Yeah, the trade across the kingdom come here. We, everyone knows we got the best weaponry, the I, best armor. I would certainly be quick to believe that. Um, perhaps a demonstration could be in order if you could show off a certain degree of your arms. Oh, oh. <laughs> we want to see us forge. <laughs> All the oh, human wants to see us forge. How cute! <laughs> yes, I must admit I'm a little bit out of my element, but I have been wowed by the stories. Let me see your sword. I draw forth. This is Dorman design. Yes. One blade. Nice pot. We were taking care of this. Yes, I have been trying to. It's been in my possession for a long time. What we have to trade? I can upgrade this for you. I can give you a new weapon, but it uh, won't be cheap. Upgrade? Uh, well, of course. We're going to sharpen it, give it a serrated edge, or chatting it with some of the NBM magic in the, in the core. Man, I wish I had a lot of gold. How much would that be? Money <laughs> 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 bags. We don't give gold down here. Relatively worthless. What? We want goods. <laughs> <laughs> don't tell me you're just gonna pull out the bag of rubies. I and I take out and I take out a and I take out a, a finely cut emerald. Yep. Um, Don't treat them like villagers. No. They are acting to enchant him with emeralds. No. Minecraft simulator. Dude. Oh my god. Where did you get the? Besides, do you know where the emerald came from? Besides just you know your house. Um, probably not, because the, the kind of the whole thing that I was that I was thinking is that she got her mother's jewelry box and just gotcha. like put okay. some, just put some various stuff in Bro, there. Are you giving away your mother's and mother's no, 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 it's her mother's jewelry box. Okay, but is your mother still it's a alive? different. Oh, your mother's not alive. No. No. Sorry. No, no worries. Uh, persuasion. Yep. Uh, eleven. See? Eleven. What about okay. seventeen? Uh, the, the wolf stalks forward. I want to roll a six. Watch. Gray, like gray gloved, uh, oh, a skin yeah. hand. Reach out to take the emerald. May I? Of course. Uh, sure. Oh, a human cut. <sighs> Get rid of half the half the gem just for the old clean edges. Despicable. <laughs> Ten gold. Ten. Ten gold. For the emerald. Yeah, for the emerald. How much would it be for the enchantment? Make it fifty. Fifty? Oh, I think that's right. Yeah, it's all right. Yeah. I take um, I take twenty. Oh, right. He doesn't like gold. Um, you remember you have a hundred GP worth of worth jewelry of worth, and gems worth and whatnot. Of so I take out. I do take out. Uh, Is there anything else you want besides? Sugar mom, you're just getting your new sword. <laughs> I'm afraid I don't have much on me, but I'd be happy to help you with anything if you'd like. <laughs> well, unless you can cast magic from your fingers and bring our forge to greater strength, I suppose, I suppose there's much you can do for us. I can't cast that much magic and I'm going to cast. I'm going to cast light. Um. <laughs> oh, oh, and I try to shake it. I try to shake it off. This like, no, ah, I'm sorry, I didn't ah. mean that, I didn't mean that. How do I, how do I get this off? <laughs> uh, bloody magic. Shadow, breeze. Alternatively, I can train my services. Yeah. I thought it has been a while since we have born down here. Uh, Maybe uh, you can teach one of them? Uh, dragon folk was right. No, it's entertainment. Oh, but horrible. You with monsters and all weapons, anything else? Dragon is okay. Um. Well, if I may, and I gesture for my sword back. Uh, right, of course, there you go. <laughs> um, if we could get a lay of the land and a look around first, and then we may discuss business, and if our bar may play the while. <laughs> the acoustics are indeed wonderful in this cavern. I'm gesturing for the emerald back. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, keep it. Not worth much for us. We'll discuss business. <laughs> <later. laughs> Alright, so. 
you guys um, leave uh, this chamber, leaving the uh, Durgar to, to return to, to their uh, work. It seems to be um, carving. One of them is, is writing out on some like thick, um, thick coarse paper. It looks to be letters or something. And the other and the others are um, chiseling away at this uh, these various metal um, metal artisan tools. <laughs> um, but you go uh, deeper in the chamber, accompanied by one only one of the Dur- Durgar. Um, and the goblin who is shadowing behind, holding his blinking um, white uh, crystal sphere. Magnus, would you like an upgrade? What are you suggesting? Anything you'd want, whether to be a little sharper or. I have no intention of getting rid of the sword, but a little bit of fine tuning would have used to that. Would anyone else like anything? <laughs> I don't really fight with weaponry. I'm not very capable with that, so it's all up to you. I like my own equipment that I made. I think. I think it's also very well put, though. Thank you. I don't think instruments are better. <laughs> Ooh. Wait, hold on. I need to get stealth check, actually. Oh, 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 no. What am I, what am I, like, one of my plan notes was to ask you where your loot came from. <laughs> but you announced it in front of... Wait, make a self check, please. Oh no! Oh, I almost had a point. <laughs> oh I got no! A six. A uh, six. Oh! Did you? Did you it's not stealing. Is it? He said elvish is better. Oh! Let me clarify. Your instruments are better. Your swords and weaponry and armory are far superior than any elvish thing I've ever seen. Are you telling the truth? Well, I mean. <laughs> you haven't seen any. <laughs> oh, no. oh, the bard lies. Oh, oh the bard. Which one's he stopping on? Fourteen. Fourteen. Oh. Yeah. For persuasion or deception? Deception. Deception. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, the flattery. All right, here goes. Natural one. Okay, barely. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, that was yeah. close. Watch the oh, You are your tongue, bard. We don't have infinite patience around here, and not much practice interacting with you. Don't be rude. <laughs> well, they are Sky a lot I'm the only bard this year in 15 Skyfolk. years. Still, that's not uh, you're right. I haven't seen you your life before. That one being me. What are you, fun guy? I'm not fun. Um, I think I am not. I, I am a Mykonid. Mykonid. I think we heard nothing about you. You live up north, right? That is correct. Well, we had a trade relation with your people one time. That was hundreds of years ago, but they had some very interesting technology with their spores. I might question you later. And he turns around and uh, keeps walking deeper into the into the caverns. Um, make a perception check. <laughs> so did I. I thought that was a die, and I thought he was crying. I heard a crunch, and I thought it was. Busted. As you pass one of the bi- of the carved, uh, this yeah, is like a carved it. hole in like not chamber ah. passageway okay. into the stone. Uh, you can hear looks to be a list like sh- like sm- um, very soft clinking and um, uh, and like grunts with ca- populated by occasional yells coming from uh, deep down uh, to your right. Uh, excuse me, what what's down yonder? Oh, down over the oh, right. well, let's just say uh, not every visitor to this place is uh, nice. Mind if I? Go see what's down there. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't let you do that. Is it dangerous? Not for you. Not for you to get on our bad side. I see. There is a good side to you, too. <laughs> we are here as <laughs> friends <laughs> and visitors uh, and admirers of what we have done. <clears throat> well, we'll be on our way then. I see us none of you sneak off to go down and investigate the mystery. Sounds like you want us to do it. <laughs> and there is in fact a mystery. I um, thought the greatest attraction of Kaiserfell was the forge. Oh, you tourists. Always looking for the next fix of your uh, mysteries and adventures. Well, no, no. We just have uh, some dissidents. We'll call it that. What kind of dissidents? Well, uh, I don't suppose you need to know that, do you? The I kind mean? that you would prefer removed? The kind that we would prefer hidden away. Hidden away. Yeah. Now, okay. c- come on. We don't uh, have much time before one of the next cycle begins. And I recommend you might want to see that. Yes, we would. 
Uh, moving uh, okay, down. Like, keep note of where this was. <clears throat> Absolutely, yes. Uh, moving down uh, further in the hall, um, he, he moves into um, another chamber, carving forward and to the left. Um, uh, down the. Uh, but it is, it is more like decorated, it has like an actual door uh, and whatnot. But when he goes inside, there is there, there's racks on the walls and like large chambers. It's like think think of um, you know that scene in the Matrix where all the guns on shelves go flying oh. in. But but the, there's various like swords, like like giant axes, big, big hammers, and uh, shields lined up against the uh, walls. A uh, large weapon racks that stretch all the way to the ceiling. Wow, it's just like I've seen in the Matrix. <laughs> <laughs> the Matrix is now canon. <laughs> the all important question. Are they all Duogar scale, or are some of them humanoid scale? Uh, yeah, so it actually looks, it looks like most of them are humanoid scale, uh-huh. um, as the, the Duogar seem to have little need for weapons uh, on their personal uh, personal use, and you and make I'm weapons sure largely for commerce. <laughs> they have their own. It's like a it's like a formal suit that they've got in their closet. <laughs> this one yes, I exactly. wore to my wedding. <laughs> <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> but the the ones set out for what seem to be a commercial. Um, or organization are all, not all, mostly humanoid sized. Is there like some that are like giant sized? There are. T- there is a giant hammer and a giant axe on what they're on, on their own sh- own shelf that look to be sized for a uh, large, uh, not a large, a huge creature. Is the hammer stuck into a large boulder and a really uh, bad tournament arc set on top of it? Tournament arc. That's a joke no one here got. Stop making references. <laughs> we don't know. No, sorry. We're all nerds. Seven Deadly Sins. Like, oh, I'll never abandon that. You know. I watched it, but... Yeah, fair enough. Okay, yeah, so... Good. This has to be the greatest collection of arms I have ever witnessed in my entire life. <laughs> it always is! <laughs> Those are not arms. arms. Those are weapons. Arms also mean weapons. Mm, I it's This weird. one's my favorite. And the, 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 the goblin goes off to the side, and they're, they're just, just like an entire collection of knives. They're like various ones that are, that are like wicked and, and curved, and the ones that are straight and, and, and narrow. Um, Ichabod seems completely taken aback, looking at all these weapons, and he's 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 like checking his own, like almost like he's in. <laughs> Better like his club. Like he's he's he's, 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 he's tapping to make sure he, everything's still on him. Touch nothing. It's not the size that matters. <laughs> Way you wield it. Don't say that. <laughs> oh. That being said, that guy gave you wasn't a smaller one. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> no! No more! The bard keeps the best tools, so. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways. Get Diego out. Kick him out. So, uh, what, what do you do now that you, you, that you are here in, the, in, this, in this collection? Um, for the purposes of if anyone wants to make any purchases, I would say sort of any any base weapon that you can you can think of is is here. You just want to describe it to me, and then that will be available somewhere in, in the shop. I do want to ask. Yeah. Um, I do want to ask one of them. How how different is it to increase to increase the defense of someone versus increasing the offense of a, of a sword? Sorry, are you asking this in character? In character, basically, how much? How what's the difference between adding a plus one AC versus adding a, a plus one to wow. what, uh, an attack? I'm asking because. Well, yeah. If you want to do it the old-fashioned way, arm is always a lot harder to, to work with. Weapons, they're pretty easy. You sharpen them, they're giving you more reach, or something like that. Oh, no, you have to rework the whole thing and add more plates, layers. Might make it heavier in the process. Magically, yeah, it's about the same. Magically about the same. Right. To increase the defense. Right, about, yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, I have little to offer by way of coin, or uh, by way of goods, but I always readily offer my services. <laughs> right, man. Uh, <laughs> no offense, uh, but you a bit skinny in the armor's department. <laughs> you, you, you do Only those. 16 strength. Uh, uh, as a dwarf, <laughs> like he just he just has these massive uh, arms and like, like, like oh built. for sure, uh, like just <laughs> just years, hundreds of years of just pounding on an anvil. We'll do that to you. <laughs> yeah, that's just, no. <laughs> I'm not finishing that one. Okay. Yes. Okay. Will I be of Wait. service to you then? You, uh, you are study. We made some interesting weapons with some, yeah. 
uh, technology based around your sport, and I want to see if we can pull out the old diagrams. But I'll be a while. Uh, yeah. Um, if we are perfectly content to spend a day or perhaps two here. Well, I suppose I can arrange accommodation for willing customers. Uh, hey, Google, show, show, show them to their chambers. Uh, <laughs> how much would it And if there is any audience um, that you wish our esteemed bard to um, perform, let them know. We'll, we'll, we'll gather up uh, a, bit, a selection of an audience in, in a day or two, and you can perform then. Uh, unfortunately, it's difficult to get everyone off their shift at the same time, but we'll make it work. There'll be a time where everyone's off their shift at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> How the Everybody's going to see the most center? interesting thing in 15 years. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> All um, right. I'll Don't worry, guys. To... I have a plan. <laughs> <laughs> Not a very good one, but a plan. Yeah, that's a good one. Just so, uh, Gubalus uh, goes down the uh, various the chambers. Uh, <laughs> after a while, the it starts to become less stony and more seems to be built out of wood, um, using metals as support and whatnot. It's still built into the rock, but it is lined by wooden support beams and other sorted um, more familiar to what you might know until you reach a room that is coated entirely in wooden planks and with um, fabric draped over the walls. It is dusty as as, as hell. There are, um, the, 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 it is clear no, no cleaning crew has been in here. It's all perfectly arranged, but the room is very old and would likely need a bit more spruce enough to be comfortable. <laughs> I'm going to cast Press Digitation to clean off the room. Thank you very much. <laughs> so, so, so you, you'll go about with your, your hands sparkling with arcane energy. I'm like, like, oh, I have to pick the... Oh, it's clean just, already. Just, just flick your hands away, dust... <laughs> flying through the air, cl- cl- being like collecting into piles on the ground that you can flick out the door. Um, you go, I can't deal with a dirty room. <laughs> I, also, I also take out uh, a block of incense and I just start burning it too. You both are making me anxious, as I'm going to mention to Shiloh as she's doing that. Um, if you ever feel like a flame is going to burst out of you, just keep, keep calm right. and, take, and take deep breaths. I think I'm getting the hang of it, and as yes. I cast it, it like, my face. <laughs> 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 Take it, take it one step at a time. It's better to <laughs> adjust slowly to these kinds of things. Okay, don't splash me in the face with light. I'll try my best not to. I'm gonna stop that would for probably a second because I can't see. I pull out, I pull out some sort of like, like a ba- it's like a basically a pocket square. You don't know where I pull it from. I can't I just see it because I can't. No, I go, I go ahead and try to like get dust out of your eyes. Oh, okay, thank you. Uh, the. Uh, Gubalus, uh, as you guys are, are spruce up this room, uh, he's, he's holding the, the corner of his uh, light. He, he puts it on, on the uh, shelf so it's casting light into the room. Tap that twice to turn it off, and uh, yeah, if there's anything else I can do, just. Yeah, just. I just put a knock on the wall. I'll be sitting outside waiting for you to call me, so just let me know. Okay, thank you. <laughs> thank you very much. So he, he walks thank around you very outside. Much, Sir Mm, I, I like the sound of that. And then he the walks out the door, uh, goes to the side, and just immediately sits down outside the door. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm going to look at you. I, I'm, I'm only speaking to you, by the way, because oh, I'm yeah. telling something. I will be a spider, and I will go see. They will not see me. Not yet. You can hear me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I told them to trust other people. I'm cleaning. I'm cleaning. Uh, you have shown that you are smart. Ooh, and I will happening. follow your thoughts. Do they have candles? Who are you talking to? Uh, they are candles, but they are. Oh, oh, no. oh, 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 so, so, so you, this is the first time that you have left the presence of any one of us in how long? Quite a bit. Several months? Yes. Right, okay. Yes, it is. So, so you walk to a corner. Um, but it's like, it's a direction, you know? Like, I'm following the direction. <laughs> so <laughs> your, your body shifts, contorts, wriggles down the, the flesh contracting. You make wild shapes sound so gross. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Until, boy. It means mushroom. <laughs> Do we see him doing this? I felt. <laughs> Wait. You do actually, yeah. You don't. For the first time in a while, you do not feel me in your mind. 
Uh, I think he stepped out to get check out the advisor. He doesn't step out. I saw him step out. He usually doesn't. Uh, <laughs> this is his first time in the Underdark in a while, isn't it? So Google this. I just poked my head out. He, 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 yes! Uh, actually, I poked my head out. Like, <laughs> um, you guys are facing each other. You <laughs> didn't happen me. to... We're both very animated. <laughs> uh, um, kindred spirits. Uh, you didn't happen to see a Mykonid go in this direction, did you? No, oh. sir! Do we know that he can wild shape? No. no we don't know him. yet, do I've we? Never seen him, I've never seen him do Dude. that before. I, I also didn't see him because I was facing away. I was looking at you guys to stop you guys from seeing him walk out. So I don't know if he's no wild shape either. Well, I, I sure do love cleaning. How does it smell in here? It should smell like Thank roses. you for your assistance. I am going to sit down I and try not to panic. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to I'm going to breathe sweet. for a solid minute. Yes. And it's think. Like sweet but not the right. sugars. Uh, during that time, Sam, do what are you trying to do? Uh... Well, I mean, I was playing music, and then I see him sit down, and I'm gonna be Magnus. Uh, I'll get you one. Where did he go? Okay. Did they take him? No. What do you mean? I may have sent him to go check out the room. How? Oh, he asked me. What did you do? How did he go? What if he's in trouble? He said he turned to his back. He can do that. <laughs> I didn't see thought you would know. <laughs> I thought I would know. He's never done that before. Wait, have you done that before? And we're just I think conically, just because it would be funny, it's just, I'd always be able to do it. I just never did. <laughs> 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 or there were points in times where he would, where he like, he would just randomly transform just because, and Magnus would lose him and be like, "Where are you?" Like a, chi- like a lost child, but you really, think he, he wouldn't just, like, explain it. You think it's obvious? Yeah. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Uh, you guys can't transform? Okay, so you yeah. are... So we're just gonna sit here, meanwhile, <laughs> panic. So, so you're uh, going towards the, the room that you mentioned earlier, right? He can handle himself. He's six. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. This guy has a mushroom. Does really? anyone want to do, want to do anything before we cut away to Fel? I'm, I'm <laughs> before we do a cutaway again. I'm myself and <laughs> go. That's your prerogative. Are you doing that? I'm asking you, would you like me to? Oh, great. Um, do not... You cannot disguise yourself. They are all Duaga. You will stick out like you will look like an elf. I can't. And then disguise they will kill myself. You. I can't. I'm gonna let him disguise himself, and then we'll be the judge. <laughs> okay. So what are you disguising yourself as? Uh, a dwarf. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> okay. Dude, so how tall are you? Are you? Yeah. How, that's a good question. I thought you could change sizes. With- <laughs> no, <laughs> it's, it's disguise kit. Oh. Like makeup and. Oh. Like, Do you like, have you know, like fake nose and. I don't have this guy's self. Oh. Just. For... Size comparison. This guy. Compared no, to. No, 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 but the thing is, the thing is, I'm gonna tuck my knees. Close I was to my dude, chest. That's what I was <laughs> thinking. I have, cl- I have a cloak, so I'm just gonna wrap it around. I'm gonna, like, kind of duck walk. Okay. This is make... the size comparison. <laughs> make, make a performance check. I explicitly tell. 15! <laughs> Okay. I, ex- I explicitly tell you that this is not a good idea. So, and so you, you like you you put you put on like this gray powder covering your face. You, I don't think you this t- is a very t- good your, idea. Uh, <laughs> your ears back and, and put put on a wig with like a, you know, your fake beard that makes you look look, look long and, and um the, with the sunken skin. Um, it's you you maybe not done this particular disguise before, but you you've ma- changed your appearance quite a few I, times. I sent you what I did. I gotta roll to see how much mm-hmm. I believe. It. Yeah, I'm gonna, wow, you look just like it. I'm also gonna do it. I'm also gonna do it. Oh, I wish I had a coin. Shit. <laughs> Diego gets another counter. I will say explicitly, not a good idea. I got this. Don't worry. Uh, okay, so, so you, you walk Don't out. Don't worry, um, you have a plan? <laughs> as, 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 you, you walk out. He really does look like a Duergar. <laughs> Oh, um, sir! He, he, he gives you a bell. I'm sorry, I didn't, I didn't know you were in there. Who was I here? Post. Right, of course, yes. <laughs> <laughs> right away! He keeps repeating bows, and then just sits back down at his door, scratching his head. <laughs> um, so so you, you you move out through the um, uh, through, through the hallway. Does and anyone want to play Dragon Chest? <laughs> Wait, with that, we cut away. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I think you, you might wait for him as he as, cause, as he comes out. and How then large of a spider are you? Tiny. But you could also just crawl on me. Speed is 20 feet. Oh, that's so much better than I expected. Wow, that's a 
fast spider. <laughs> spiders oh, that's terrifying. It's so 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 oh, six seconds. Oh, I I'm, that. Just, I'm just walking down. It's so like. <laughs> I, have, I have two HP, but I have my speed is 20. It's like, it's like, so it's do you just want to crawl like on him? I'm crawling. Oh, yeah, I'm on your shoulder. Well, you don't know. It's a. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but did I see you like your boat? Up? You told him you were gonna disguise yourself, correct? Uh, uh, yeah. Okay. Oh, later. Like, <laughs> I love, imagine your boat disguised and don't recognize each other. Well, like, he's not this one. <laughs> so, so you you, you <laughs> zoom up as as on uh, ultra, ultra shoulder. He's like, ooh, oh. a spider. I just like with one of my uh, eight legs. I just like tap your shoulder and like just wave. Right. Do you guys know Morse, <laughs> you guys know Morse code? Um, and no. You, you make your way um, to down the chamber, um, thankfully not encountering any other door bar, uh, until you, fi- you find yourself in front of the doorway, from which you can hear the <laughs> coming from far, f- further down. Practice. I open the door. The door creaks open, uh, revealing a dark chamber lined by uh, unlit sconces uh, that l- line the walls. Um, the floor is rough cut, as if it was hastily made um, and only recently added, uh, the, but the walls are clean and there are um, many f- footprints of th- that um, escape the path. This has been used many times. Do I know anything about them? Do you know anything about them? Yeah. Make a history check. Do I also know anything about Rogar? You too. <laughs> Not one. Woo! Let's that's go. Seven. Let's go. That's another one. That's another one. Really badly. Um. Well. <laughs> okay. Um. I I personally know very little about Rogar. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's tomes of Rogar. But um, you you know. So this is only one um, location of Rogar that exists in the world. Uh, there are many. Uh, but they're they're known for being exceptional craftsmen. They n- rarely, if ever, go outside um, into, into the light. Um, but they're savvy businessmen and known for getting the best out of um, most economic deals, especially with dealing with a forge, forges and um, selling tools. All right. And I'm just gonna keep walking down while like kind of swiveling my head. Make perception. Do you have dark vision? I don't. I have dark vision. So. Spider. Make make perception check. Yeah. Eight. Eight. <laughs> You um, have not been rolling good. You rolled a two, a three, and a three on perception. Yes, I have. Okay. Uh, so even with that low roll, uh, you see that as you're pushing the end of the hallway, there is a, a Durgar in like a, a, a black mask. Uh, it's, a, it's a black hood that goes all the way over his face. Um, but you can tell this beard, this beard is coming out from underneath. So you tell this, this Durgar. Um, he's wearing a, what looks to be robes with like just generic armor plates um, over, over the front and sides. Um, and he's standing with a, um, see, he's standing on a chair with a small battle axe uh, o- over his knees, and he just seems to be kind of idly walking back and forth, facing away from the, from where you guys are coming from. I just tap your shoulder as a spider and just like, I, 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 I like try to motion. Like, How do you gesture? You know, it's like you don't have a like, head. I have like he jumping spiders do. Legs. Yeah. Some jumping spiders do have like. This like, you gotta like, be a like, like, legs. You gotta be a tarantula. I'm a tarantula. I'm a tarantula. <laughs> yeah. Dance. Okay. And then I'm just like, gesturing like towards the per- like the, the dude away. I mean, so like, like, so you can just like, and, and with this notice as you walk forward, you can see him. Oh, I do have bangs. Yeah. yeah. So you can just little fuzzy bangs. I just push forward at that point. Uh, do I see anybody else besides? No. And the sounds are they coming from? They're loud. They're loud enough. Come from just the next chamber. The next chamber. It's indistinct words, but you can hear there's some yelling coming from the nearby chamber. Uh, he's facing away, so I'm gonna like get rid of him and just. <laughs> so, so you're already you're already on. Oh <laughs> oh you're already very close to the ground, but you, you, you continue being lower, crouching forward. Make a stealth check. Yeah. Uh, twenty-two. Twenty-two. Dang. I have plus one stealth. Uh, okay. Uh, he's running on it because you're on the open. Never mind. <laughs> So you, you sneak by, keep close to the wall, check and make sure that this 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 like dwarf doesn't see you. But he <laughs> seems not to be watching the hallway. He seems to be watching deep into the deeper into the darkness, um, as if he's keeping something uh, keeping something in, not out. Um, you go further around the wall, on the wall towards the end of the chamber. Eventually, you find you think you're in the dark well enough to keep continue forward until you uh, find a line um, of what looks to be rough hewn. Buildings set cut into the stone. Uh, on one side, there are thick metal bars. 
and if you look deep inside, you can see there are huddled forms sitting in groups um, in these small cramped rooms. What do you do? Are there any Dwargar in those cramped rooms? They look to all be humanoid. Uh, hello? <coughs> a couple of them have their heads up. They're around. Who, who, who is it? You, oh, they, they, they see you're, they see you're a, a, you look like a door guard. And the sheriff's going to go, no, wait, 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 You like pull down your beard like a <laughs> shadow. Check it out! <laughs> but don't I look sick? <laughs> um, and uh, and the, and, the, and one of the, and one of the men comes to the front of the um, the chamber. He, he, he holds onto the bar and looks down at you. Uh, and you see that um, in his um, in, with your unaltered face, if you were given um, perhaps. Many weeks worth of scruff and letting your hair and go to general unkemptness, he would look exactly like you, Samuel. And with that, I think we will take what? our. Wait, body. wait, wait! What? <laughs> <laughs> Hold up! We're gonna be gone for ten minutes. Uh, and wait, stay tuned. <laughs> wait, wait! You called him what, Samuel? Samuel. Oh, we we are oh. going to have a ten minute break. When we come back, we're going to reveal the mysteries of what just took place. Stay yeah, tuned fun. Um, and have a wonderful break. See you soon. What? <laughs> and we're back. We're going to go straight back into the action. So this figure, um, with his his gone skin, um, he has he has multiple weeks worth of of, of beard and hair. Um, and all the rest of the prisoners in the cell look similarly disheveled. They're all looking at you in confusion and surprise because you, who lo looks like a Draugr, um, not Draugr, Durgar, who <laughs> looks like a Durgar, has, has just um, revealed herself to be of something of a different nature. Um, I'm gonna first cast Healing Word on Um, okay. So, you, can you describe what you do to cast Healing Word? Uh, I'm gonna like pull out my loop really quietly and kind of like lightly strum it and send me like, send a few over. short notes tum, 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 tum. And the, 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 the rhythm uh, passes through the bar and <coughs> <coughs> oh. Oh. I'm the arms it really is you we've been tapped here for so long how did you how did you find us I thought you were in high law. I was we sent out on a mission. Oh, it, the Zugar, they, they left, they left our caves. They left them, Sam, they left them. Uh, are all of you here going high law? We were, we were, we were heading back. We were heading back for a mission. But the, they intercepted us. We were a whole strike team. Uh, they Justin's personal, personal forces and, oh, they killed so many. How, how do I get you out? The god comes to along once a day. He has a key on his belt and gives us food. Is, is he the one sitting down there? He, he looks over, but it's it, the angle isn't quite such that he can see him. I don't know which it might be. Big axe? I thought they all carry those. Oh boy. They, they use them on us if we get out of line. Please shake that for a moment. Please, you have to free us. I have to return Justin. Tell him the do do I have turned against him. Yeah, I'm not gonna do that. Can I crawl into a lock? I can like, stick my like appendages like into a lock and like play with it. That's, That's gonna be one heck of a sleight of hand check. <laughs> nat 20. Nat 20. Nat 20. Nat 20. Guaranteed 20. 20. 20. 20. 20. I mean, hey. I'll call it DC 20. Guaranteed 20. Guaranteed 20. So I have a plus two sleight of hand. I mean, 25. You never know. That's a 19. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Okay. So you, 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 you stick your hands, in, 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 like your spider arms, into the lock and start moving around the tumblers. It's, it's hard and shaky. The, the middle pieces are just, just a little bit too complex for you to figure out as in your little spider brain. I just shrug as a spider. <laughs> well, he's got the, he's got the normal brain, normal intellect. Yes. Yeah, but like that was the magic. Crammed, <laughs> crammed into the brain. It's what's really uh, comfy. I'm here with some other people. Uh, did they trust me? I think. <laughs> Not anymore. <laughs> yeah. 
There's no way you can break out. There's miles of stone between us and the surface. I, I mean, I've been looking for you. <clears throat> I'm so sorry I left. It's... It's... If you can get one of the guards and get to his confidence, steal the key somehow, I, I assume you can keep it up on your skills. Yeah. Just one hell of a time to fail now. Oh, I'll, I'll see what I can do. Maybe, maybe that one down there. If he has a key, I'll knock him out. Come around. Whatever you do, do it fast. I don't know how long you have before they're discovered. I mean, I'm gonna <laughs> sneak back and see if it, can I see if that guard has a key on it? Make another stealth check. Sixteen. Like, like okay. Uh, yes, he, so he, he does have a key on him, but oh, it, okay. it's um it's, it's under some flaps of clothing. It's under some flaps. I want to crawl I, I, up and try to grab the key. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <coughs> hmm. So what was the strength score of a spider? Two? It is, um, I believe it's a negative ne- four. It's a two, so it's negative four. It's two, okay. If it's sleight of hand, it's Can plus. you make an athletics check for me? Oh, dear God. <laughs> oh, dear God. Nat 20, nat 20, Guaranteed nat 20. 20. Nat this wasn't 20. really bad, I'm not gonna. Nat 20. dropped it on a one. That's a nine. It's a minus four right here. Okay, so, so we, you, you crawl up his leg, and you, you're trying to you're trying to lift um, this. Oh, so you're trying to lift this ring of keys out from off of this guy's belt, um, but he, he looks down, just gives him a jiggle, tries to slap at his side. What's your AC? That's Twelve. <laughs> With you miss. <laughs> Not only did he miss. Purple? Nat one. Yeah. Yeah. Nat one. So guys, I have a plan, and it's that he's gonna roll he one. That's the plan. We can do no wrong because he'll do all the. So it happens. Is he slaps at his at his side, and it, it just it jostles the keys, and it not 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 only does it completely miss you, it jostles the key enough that it falls off and down to the ground. Oh my god! Oh, he's okay. gonna try to see if he can perceive that. <laughs> no way. Okay, he does. Oh, <laughs> oh man. <laughs> You were so close. Are Gorgar immune to sleep? No. I'm gonna cast sleep. Okay. Uh, he roll can see points. you casting. Yeah, but, but he can't you can fall asleep if he. Uh, so he, he leans down to, in order to pick up the keys. Oh, oh he, he doesn't see you. Yeah. Casting. Is it verbal somatic material? Or he will it? hear me cast. And, and you will actually and you boom, strum oh your, your lullaby chords. That's another good guitar riff. Fingers. <laughs> Twenty hit points. Oh, you, you, you are so, so unlucky. No, twice. So sorry. I should have attacked him before. Wait, roll for his hit points. <coughs> what? Roll for the dual hit points. No, I have the. I have the. <laughs> yeah, but they always have. The, I was gonna. Always have the or if he has to roll for hit points, you have to roll. For <laughs> yeah, points. I, I know. Okay. 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 All right. Well, I'm just saying. Watch. He's gonna get. He's gonna get forty gonna get hit points now. He's, he's gonna, gonna get forty, and then it's, he's gonna absolutely destroy him. It's crazy. Oh, watch us eat our words. Oh, Shit, no. that's so wait, many. Wait, got um, you again. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> it's only fair. It's over 20. This is gonna bite us in the butt later. <laughs> is he at no 20? 19? Is he exactly at 20? 20. <laughs> yes! <laughs> yes! <laughs> oh, no. I have a real life charisma of 18. <laughs> <laughs> Undeserved sleep. <laughs> I've sleep my time. Shape, shape. Good job, good job. Man, I love you. <laughs> we win these. Yeah. All right, so so you show him the lullaby, and and with a deep soothing. <laughs> Plays a Metallica rift. Um, and the the wave washes out. <sighs> Rippling the air with a magic art energy for washing over the door guard. Who looks like. I'm gonna snatch that key. Just. Oh, I'm running. So, wait, how are we gonna get out, though? Because there's gonna be people gonna see just their prisoners just walking away. Okay. Wait, wait. Did you open the. I'm about to. That's not the plan. I have a very. Um, so okay, we're playing dragon chess. <laughs> we're sure playing dragon chess. Happening. What are you doing there oh, during this time, Mel? <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna watch the entrance to the kid. Okay. Um, just because he, I can't right, sure. as a spider. Yeah, you, you pass perception. Look out. 
So, so you, you, you go forward, you bring, bring the keys, um, the prisoners inside look to you, like, wide-eyed as you... <laughs> tumbles, tumbles fall open and... <laughs> As the, as the gate creak, creaks um, open and prisoners spill out, like anxiously looking around, they are haggard and they're tired. They're stumbling on legs that are that look emaciated. Um, they're clearly not getting enough food. Um, but Sam grabs his shoulders. Says, ah, I've, I've dreamed so many nights of you finally coming back. And, oh, shit. I, words can't express how much. But there are other cells. We aren't the only ones here. <laughs> I'm just gonna go down. He, how many keys down. does this guy have? Does he have like forty that he has to go like? Well, no. So um, <clears throat> what, what looks to be there's there's about five keys on the ring, but the what, the one that you found in order to click it open works for every single okay. um lock. Ooh, the master key. That the one that just happened to fall off is the one that. Yeah. No, no, no. The whole ring fell off. Oh. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> just like. <laughs> so uh, so you, you go down the line, clicking, clicking, clicking. Um, if you complete all the cells as people are spilling out. It's, you're going to use up your minute, and you're not going to be able to get out before he wakes up. Yeah. Okay. okay so, then I'm going to position myself, like, on the on top of the ceiling, above him. That's it. Okay. When he wakes so up, he, I will... He's so laying... Wait, are you doing, like, spider web going down? No, I'm, I'm, like, on the roof above okay. him. Okay. I'm just waiting for him to wake up. So he he is sprawled on the ground <clears> with <throat> his head off to the side, and <sighs> drooling out of his mouth, and, did, like, mixing with his beard. Um, Checkmate. I'm going to tell the people spilling out that he's going to... He's gonna wake up. Soon. They're they're nodding like they're moving forward. They're I'm like. Having a hand. So so as, as you unlock the, unlock the last cage and the the swarm people start, you know, there's a slow low rum of chatter as people are whispering like, "What's going on? You're freeing us." The people are grasping on the shoulder like, "Thank you, thank you." Uh, there is there is an overwhelming praise and fear um, at what is lying beyond. There are actually some people that are that stay like clambered up in their cage like, "No, I won't leave." Um, <laughs> there being like people out there, they're comments trying to pull away. Some, some accept, but there are the few that stay there, just shaking, rocking back and forth themselves, um, and will are unable to be prepared to leave. But you, you move the way towards the entrance as the. <coughs> I'm gonna draw my rapier, stab him. Uh, okay. He's um, so he's pro, so you have advantage, but he's not incapacitated anymore. Whoa! Oh. Okay, I'm gonna roll that twenty. Guarantee oh, no. twenty. Guarantee twenty. That one. It's yeah. okay, it's okay. You have 16. 16, 16 hits. Um, so what are the two rolls? Six, uh, 16. Wait, who are you attacking? He's attacking, two. He's uh, attacking the door guard. He's just going, oh, I, I thought he woke up. Or he's, he's about he to wake up. He is waking up, so he's up and he's yeah. stabbing him. Oh, because so. I was... No, okay. There, there, there's, a, there, there, there's a... There's a... As we're... Through his wait, clothes, wait. Uh, oh between two pieces of armor, uh, he goes... No, I have to kill this guy first. What's going on? And he, he, he scrambles for his for his axe, grabs it, brings it this to uh, swipe at you. Uh, he's going to make an attack roll. Uh, um, that's going to be a 14. Dang, just needs it. <laughs> okay, oh. so he's going to roll for damage. Needs it, needs it. And I wonder uh, what's going on in the other room. Oh, you're trying now? <laughs> you're trying Dragon Chance? Okay, I'm going to try Dragon Chance. Alright. Um, so as, 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 as the, the, the bison stride tosses you, you to, to the ground, um, as a as girl, she comes to feet. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Little help. Yeah. How tall is the roof? Uh, like 10 feet, maybe? I'm gonna use my action to shift from a spider into a bear and fall directly on top of them. Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> or I guess bonus action. <laughs> Um, God, roll it. a straight 20. Oh my God. No, no modifier. No, no, no. That's a 16. No. No. What do I roll for that? For damage wise. You so you are above 200 pounds? Yeah. You fall yeah. on 10 feet? Yep. Yep. You will roll 1d6 damage. Okay. And then he gets to Three. attack him too, right? What? Bonus action. What did you say? I, because I'll Wait, sorry, how much damage did you deal? Are you a move? Uh, yeah. Three. Three. Oh, and so you get to. Move. I can still attack him. That was my bonus action. Yeah, how much damage do you deal? Three. Three. All right, and your attack? Next is a 16. And uh, a 15. 15 hits. Cool. So the first one is six piercing. And then my claws. Uh, that's 11. You killed him. I just, I maul this guy. <laughs> okay, so, so with a, with a, with a, with a song. <laughs> Your body twists from the top ropes. Your spider legs twisting and furling out to giant hairy limbs with claws that you fall swiping down. 
raw, unhinged your jaw, clamping down. Um, please describe how you kill this, this Durgar. Uh, first, I bite the neck, and then I tear open its chest. Oh. So the head, the, the head comes off, and I tear open its, like, front body. Stop, stop, he's already dead. I, when I attack, I'm there to kill. I'm efficient, and I want to do it. Yeah, we can see that. So, that happened. The I cycle see. of life, everybody. Well, I'm 34. After, after you do that, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna <laughs> to say to you, I'm going to say, Fel, don't tell anybody. I'm going to look at the dwarf and I'm going to change him to a... As, uh, <laughs> <laughs> wait! So, no. I face it down as a cute cup in, ca- in case it, it wasn't um, obvious to no. our esteemed viewers, um, our real? player Sam is in fact a changeling. Um, no. <laughs> oh my god. Just, no. <sighs> your face ripples, changes, and distorts the muscles underneath r- pulling over your skeleton. Oh, the skeleton with, uh, shrinking down back into your dwarven, uh, the dwarven form, taking and analyzing his face that is now headless and on the floor. Uh, you rearrange your features until you are exact copy. The giant beard sprouting from your face, it's hair pulling that. down, and the the clothes you can take off his now it's number body. I'm going to take my previous cloak, which is like human size, and wrap him up in it and kind of hide him away. Uh, some of the other prisoners are like like just kind of awed by this sudden rescue, are now helping to like carry his, his corpse and put it push off this side. Uh, back, actually, I think what they do is they push into one of the cells and then lock it closed. <laughs> I'm going to turn oh, and say, the armory is that way. <laughs> um, are we fighting out? We're fighting out, huh? Prison uh, break? I, I'm a bear. Right? I didn't see any Gorga earlier, but there could be. I'm gonna go try and get my allies. Hopefully, they'll help us. I'm gonna. I want to. <laughs> I. What am I gonna do about a bear walking around? No, no, I'm not sure. Are allied with the dragon. <laughs> they, no. they betrayed. They bet, so like I. I know what my characters. They're gonna also do. people. I mean. <laughs> sure. <laughs> yeah. Sure. People. When you changed. <laughs> wait, by the way, when you changed into him, did you uh, look at his face and go to be or not to be? <laughs> <laughs> to no. be or not to be? That's the question. Whether well, just nobler in the mind. Just for the sl- I'm not gonna do it. Magnus has taught me to protect the innocent or the hurt. I'm gonna follow with them to the armory. Okay. I'm gonna lead them to the armory. Our room is on the way to the armory, right? No, I don't no. Think so. The hundred, the, the is, yes, uh, over over hundred feet of, the, of these emaciated survivors thudding <laughs> through the ground. Um, there are a uh, Durgar that you know that you guys. And inevitably pass that they're shouting prison up right prison up right and then you hear you're sh- shaking deep, deep in the, the heart of the forge mountain as, as more and more doers start to prepare and race towards where you are meeting I'm gonna run for the room that I was okay at. Uh, make way down down the halls. The, the stone shaking every once in a while from the from the geyser deep below, and you eventually make your way bursting into the room, b- 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 p- past uh, Gugulus, who, who just starts out from looks where he was taking a nap. Um, ha! If I what is I'm gonna maul him instantly. <laughs> oh! Okay, no, no. Are you are you going with him as a bear? I thought you were gonna protect was... them. Oh, this is a different way. way. Yeah. Oh, never mind. Leading to the armor. Then uh, please don't kill. I'm. I'm. I'm not, you're not here not to tell me not to kill. When, when I'm this protecting Xavier. This is Xavier. I'm killing. This doesn't care. Xavier cares. I'm <laughs> killing anyone who threatens because I trust you and you're smart. That's your friend that we saved. I'm gonna protect them with my life. Uh, when I see you lose, I'm gonna say, get out. <laughs> yes, and why? Well, there's, there's noise coming from now. No. Okay! <laughs> you just skip us away. Oh, and you say that as a do Yeah, yeah. And then I'm gonna open the door Do-a-gar. and I'm gonna shift back into a human. Oh! Wait, you show us? You said not to tell anyone. No, I'm shifting as a human and then opening the door. Oh, oh okay. Uh, oh. So you, you enter is back as, as, as Sam. Where's your disguise? Where's <laughs> where's <laughs> Fel? <laughs> Where of... is Fel? Prison break. <laughs> 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 You put uh, Fel in prison? Uh, no. Uh, is, where's Fel? Is, is, he, is he okay? You got him captured? No, 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 no. We, we free prisoners. I knew Calm the, down, I knew Magnus. The, also, Dwergars are, are on the dragon side. They're bad. Oh, oh. We are in dragon territory. No, no, no. The majority of the world is aligned neutral. to the dragon. They captured Trasse soldiers, and I knew one of them. Oh, so great. Wonderful. Oh, uh, what? why is it relevant? Uh, I knew him. Are they coming to kill us? Who? The duo god. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what did you do? We're gonna did you not understand that we were out. here to find something under this city? You 
can find you without Thorgar? How do you intend to? No, I don't think we can. I'm sure we can. But either way, we should probably yeah, hurry. Oh. There's pounding coming from outside. Where do we go? From, from do you down know, the corridor. Do you know where we go? Oh, I sent all the prisoners to the armory, so we should go there first. Oh, where Jesus. These are among the most. Fell is there. Is Fell okay? Fell is perfect. I'm covered in blood, by the way. Your mouth is just dripping with with gore. Like, you actually hear a loud roar down the hallway. Right from when the guy, like, oh, yeah. Do they happen to have a beast? Who? We have a beast. We do. We yeah, do. It fell. He turned into a bear. He did. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> also, my accent is, there is any gone. Way... This oh is, shit! This is purposeful. My accent is purposely gone. I'm, I'm add another. Add another one, by the way, to mine. Yeah, yeah that's right. Like, uh, the the, the, the pounding from outside is getting louder and louder. Where? Do, where? Do, where's the armory? We came from there. Oh, is the, but how? Is there any way that I could possibly get away with not being on your side? No, I don't think so. Oh, Fel's on. You want to save Fel? Fel's on my side. Save Fel? You put him in danger? No, no, no. He put himself in danger. <sighs> I am going to hastily to throw the dragon chest set in the bag. Um, we'll the pieces! <laughs> they, the were game, from, they, were, they were made from The hockey. game is up. They know we're here. <laughs> <laughs> so show us where Fel is and lead us to him. Maybe we can actually get a chance. Plus, we can leave time. one of them alive and ask them about the shifters there. Alright, you you just slam the door open. Take a pot! Uh, there's... Oh, (laughs) (laughs) Alright, yeah, alright. Stay behind us, and if someone... Don't point a weapon at my I'm not pointing... I'm sorry, I meant to be pointing a finger, not a weapon. (laughs) Give the hell I pass pass it by the hand. Don't worry, the point's that way. behind us, let us know. He has has his uh, kid's club in both hands. (gasps) Okay, sure. (laughs) Stay out of harm's way. Better the dodge than attack. Right, that's Um, okay. So, have you fought I mean, all that loot? No. Oh, okay. I mean, real does, fighting. Does Fail Wild count? <clears throat> what? Oh, I haven't mentioned it, have I? What? <laughs> Let's get moving. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> no, <laughs> just, 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 just drop that. Okay. You, you start dashing through the corridor. Your feet thudding on, on, on wooden, then stone ground. What? You, you, you make your way down to the central oh, chambers. In, in, um, in the heat of the moment, I'm going to need everyone to make a history check in order to remember wh- wh- which way towards armory. Yeah! Eso! Ooh, eight. 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 Let me double check my history. Nine? Nineteen! Nineteen? Oh, you're not there. there. I was gonna be a wizard, baby! Yeah, you... You you, you were keeping track of the... You happened to be keeping track of the way... uh, The way you were going. You were rather anxious of being trapped under so much stone, and so you made an effort to make sure that you tracked your path. As you guys turn to the corridor, you take the lead uh, as you're moving through the corridor, left left to right, and then turning down the main corridor that leads towards the armory. Uh, Suddenly, out of a side corridor... Um, about six Dorgar, clad in full, in full pl- plate mail, come clambering out, out, out of the uh, corridor. They, they, they raise all of your cannery, looks, looks to be the same, um, big, thick, uh, stout axes. And they, and, they, and they look, there they are! There's no way in which this can be, this can end in peace, can it? Yes, there can. Please leave us alone. I roared them. Oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah! <laughs> uh, so, so, you, so you guys, well, you're not here at the moment. Oh, you, you hear, you hear just in okay. roar. Um, as coming from off this, it's not distant, it's pretty close. Only Baric? one corridor away. Barrett? <laughs> oh, that's Fell. That's Fell? So, yeah. so, so the, the way the. We're the gonna have to talk about your accent so, as well. What? You, you, there's a central, uh, central corridor. There's a central corridor. Uh, uh, they came out of this one. And you and you guys are right here. You heard the roar coming out of this one. So. I'm trying to say. Cry so havoc and let's slip the dogs of war. <laughs> I'm trying to save my friend. I'm helping my friends find him. Friend so, my friend is my friend. Yeah. Okay, so this is where you guys are. These are, the, these are the door guard. They came, they came out from here. And, and from here is where you where uh, you heard Fel. We go where Fel is. Hi, Fel. I mean, he's right next if to we us. Either that go, or I just if we go towards guys. where Fel is, they control this junction, right? <laughs> they. Well, they, they're, 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 there are <laughs> many <laughs> central like corridors. Uh, this one does lead to the exit, but you figured they'd probably just follow you. They would, they would follow us, but then they block our way out, or we could try to hold them. Oh, but that's a narrower corridor. We can find out one at a time. Let's go in the narrow corridor. Kay. You could have just left it up there. <laughs> no, because he has to drop. Okay, so, you, you, you guys turn to the right and, and, and charge away. Um, are you guys following uh, Magnus, who, m- who made the first choice? Sure. Yes. Yeah. 
Ah, uh, you, you, you pass I, a few breaks. I, like, shuttle, I shuttle everybody else in first, and then I've got, like, shield and sword up until, like, so I'm in the back of the party. Sure. So it's, uh, everyone I am, I'm, right beh- I'm right behind you about to do that, uh, like, really, really uh, One of yeah. them cool. throws let's a test. Hand. Let's test you. One of them sw- sw- skids around the the, the entrance uh, to the corridor and okay. throws a hand back to you, but it does disadvantage the dodge action and gets a six. Wonderful. <laughs> uh, the, Bell, yeah. are you the bear? <laughs> uh, and, and in fact, uh, as you guys are going down this corridor t- towards what you remember to be the armory, uh, you, you see this large crowd of, of, of slowly of moving of humanoids, um, v- various humans, some elves, um, and even a few normal dwarves uh, mixed among them. As they, they're charging forward, they, they have tattered, worn robes and blue and silver of Destin's forces, illuminated by the torchlight flickering on the walls, and they're just moving in to the big chamber of the, ar- of the armory. From within, you hear the clanging shouting of battle um, moving from within as the, these humans clash with the door guard that were just recently there. They're a strike force, yeah. right? That's yeah. what he said? Uh-huh. But, but, but they've barely been fed for the past... I know they're emaciated, but these yeah. people actually have proficiencies. Yes. I thought they were just people. No. Okay, no. well that changes things. Uh, well, I do I recognize any of you them? Guys. I just told you. Not on first glance. No, this cool. is Xavier's thing. You don't tell us anything. Okay. Xavier's far more. Um, at this point, you are you are surrounded by both sides. Uh, Bell's as at, at the front of this large group of of, um, of soldiers. You guys are charging into the group of the soldiers, and behind you there are six Dorgar in, in plate mail who are charging at you. Who are charging at us? Yeah. Um, so, so, yeah. Do you have anything to break them up, Shiloh? Do you, what X? Are we doing that? this? I don't know. I don't like that. <laughs> Magnus? <laughs> what? Are we doing this? Hold! Um, um intimidation okay. check. That is a 21. 21, alright. Um, 19, 19 plus 2. They, they, they slow down and hold, hold their, their weapon where did they before them. Who was the cause of this? Was it you? You! Yeah. I don't know what's going on. Who are these people? What, what's going on? Please tell us of these people. What's... We don't know anything, we, we swear. As far as I see, I th- there's a collection of emaciated people here. Where did they come from? Um, <clears throat> you see one of them, one behind, it says for, lifts off his mask, uh, not mask, a helmet, oh. and it's Jor's uh, from before. Um, Take not a step further. Oh, I'm sorry, mate, but these men uh, can get out of here alive. And what? you, if you take this time to join with them, won't you there? What did they ever do to you? They side with the wrong side of this war. There's a new force on the on Ithaca. A new force that will supply the Dorgar with enough with metal and resources and magic to be able to uh, <clears throat> become a new world power. So Jesse can offer anything like that. So Jaws, I think you've picked the wrong trail. And I clash my sword against the cast- pavement and I cast uh, Wrathful Smite on my weapon. <laughs> and then I'm going Rap. to cast Bane because it's yours. Uh, bonus action. One's closest to us. Um, Next time I hear it. Actually, it, in oh. effect, can everyone roll initiative? Oh. Yes. Let's go. Bye. <laughs> Sorry, bro. My my allegiances are. Uh, my allegiance to, to the Republic. To the democracy. <laughs> thirteen. Yeah, I roll really poorly. Okay. Uh, also we're doing, thirteen. Okay. My dex is zero. Hey. So. I got a four. I'm a level four. Uh, four for <laughs> Elena. Uh, no, you add your dex modifier. One for one for Shilo. Nine. Quattro, oh. baby. Uh, Shilo. Uh, nine for Sam. Is my brother gonna be an initiative? Yeah, I was a, Hell no. that was, I was about to lean forward to be like, I could bomb. Did you roll like <laughs> one? Yeah. Come on, come on, twenty, 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 thirty, twenty. Come on. Dude, Do not been, charge. You watch him turn around just smack you. Like, okay, um... Hello. I tried to watch... Del, Sam, <laughs> like, uh, Magnus, what do you get? 13. 13? So, th- so... We should go together. Uh, so you two, you two have the same initiative. So if you, whoever wants to go first, Cam. Can we... Uh, okay, and the Simon doors... Jane. And I will go first. <laughs> the Simon doors Jane. got... Uh, you, five. Um... Okay. Okay, so... In, 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 in this crowded corridor with the, with the crowd of people moving into the armory with is this tilling up. Is this a 2v2 in terms of how grand we are? Uh, it, it's closer to 3 by 3 uh, th- th- three, 3 15, 15 foot wide. And we have to fight through... Oh, it's going to be a river of blood. Okay. Uh, uh, that means Ichabod, Ichabod is up first. Um, it's a river of blood. He's, he's going to... Rivers, no! Huh? <laughs> in a state of panic... He's gonna run forward and try to hit the hit hit, hit the with his club. Oh. It's not your turn yet. Sorry. <laughs> oh, no. Before I can stop him. Uh, he got a eleven. 
he he's within misses. five feet of me though, right? What is it about within five feet of me? He was behind. He he like burst through the. Yeah, front no, lines but how running. how far is the Duogar front line? Is, oh, I think he's like, like twenty feet away. Oh, so Ichabod <laughs> is not within five feet of me. Not anymore. <laughs> no. <laughs> he's, he's like, ah! he, he brings his club down. Uh, George just like step like steps out of the way, like block like the, the club pow, bangs against his armor. Um, and then. As a sister, and as Chloe, I'm very stressed right now. And then George's gonna Agnes and, and then not George, his brother. Just <laughs> just right and then George's gonna take this. Uh, he's gonna use the Sentinel feet. No! What? Now no! What? Now what? He's got Sentinels. Oh, <laughs> he's oh, the boss. Geez. Um. So okay. so he. So I think he's going to heft his axe and sw- swing towards um, I- Ichabod, but he's totally underestimates Ichabod. He, he wants to hold back, like scooting back. Ichabod, what are you doing? Get, Get back. back here! That was the one thing we told you not to do. Get back! Uh, as as the, as the axe <laughs> through, through the air over his head. Okay. Next up is uh, Thel. Cool. How far did that I away <laughs> from? Main, the big guy. I'd say about so you you can you could push through this crowd of difficult difficult terrain um, for about um, it's about thirty feet and, and then you'd be twenty feet away so you're about fifty feet in total away from. See, I have a climbing speed. Is it possible to like <laughs> wall run? Yo, <laughs> Titanfall two type feet. Titanfall two bear. Oh so my I think God. that's supposed to mean Titan bear on like trees and stuff. I'll allow it. That's cool, cool, right? Titanfall two. Let's go. Bear you, it's less Titan climbing and it's too. more. Yeah, so you see a 400 pound brown bear only seeing blood in its eyes oh, jump on, like, like barely like Pentel 2 wall ride, jump in front right next to Ichabod and multi attack him. Does he uh, double? Does he, that's it. <laughs> he got himself, he got himself, that's good. Uh, I'm just gonna multi attack, one with bite, one with claws. Okay, one hit. That's a dirty 20 hit. That hit. Nice. And a 10 doesn't hit. 10 doesn't hit. Alright, roll, roll for damage. That is uh, twelve. Okay. Yeah. Um, no. Okay. Uh, so, so you, you, so which it the bite hit or the the bite? The bite. So you ah, with a fearsome roar, you on ah, toss, clamp down right, right on his shoulder. George uh, goes, ah, you bloody beast! Where do you even come from? Um, he does not have another reaction though, so he can't attack you. Uh, next up is uh, Magnus. Think about my goat. Um, is Jorz at all? He pushed up in front, and he's up in front of the other duel guard, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, he, he's in front of all, all the rest of five. And do any <clears> of the <throat> other duel guard have in the front line? Do they have pole arms as well? Uh, they have great axes. They have great axes. Okay. Did wait, does Jorz have great axe or pole arm? Uh, Jorz also has a great axe. Yeah. Oh, okay. So Sentinel's just. Okay. Yeah, I have to get within. Um, I'm gonna say, stay back, and I'm gonna get within. I'm gonna get within five feet of Ichabod, okay. and uh, I'm gonna take a swing at George. What about me? And I'm gonna take a swing at, jo- or I'm gonna, I'm gonna look at him and say, "You don't have to do this." Oh, I'm sorry, but I do. If you're gonna sign with the wrong side of this war, and you'll die like the rest of the petty scum. You're all blind. Uh, so that's a solid uh, five. Five's not hit. Sorry. Um. So, so what weapon you use? Your sword. Uh, yeah, it's a long sword. So he, uh, he, 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 he yeah. comes down. He yeah. locks it on the shaft of his great axe. Um, and then, uh, yeah, so that's gonna be him, up, uh, after Sam, um, uh, but, he, but he raises his, his foot like he's gonna kick in the chest. Uh, next up, Sam. I'm gonna cast Bane on him. Three, three creatures? Three creatures. Okay. Uh, Jor's got a, um, seven. Fail. Uh, the next one got three twenty. The next one got a four. Fail, so two fails. Okay. And they basically get a minus one d4 to attack and saving throws. Attack rolls and saving throws. Um... Just in time. Dang. That is Sorry, can you use that one more time? Uh, minus 1d4 to attack rolls and saving throws. Okay. Um, okay, so so as, as, you, as you strum a, a hideous sounding minor chord, <laughs> this, this, this blast of music shoots forward and then stumbles back. Uh, he seems disoriented as he uh, as he raises his, um, his axe to attack. Uh, George is going to go first. Gun, he's going to attack uh, Magnus. Okay. Uh, he's going to get a seven. <laughs> okay. Um, okay. My shield is up. Uh, yeah, so he, he brings his crash. <laughs> Sparks flies. He skids off the side of your shield. Uh, next up, uh, the second door guard is going to come. Uh, he's going to attack you, a fell, and a bear. Uh, he's going <laughs> to. I need your dice. This isn't that one. <laughs> Okay, oh, wait, do you want to take mine? No, no, don't, no, don't, okay, I'm, I'm don't help him. He's got his own dice collection. 
Uh, he's a different one. Um, so, so, so she just oh, 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 swings down towards you, but, but, but you just skip back and it clanks against the stone. Uh, the, other one, the next one is going to attack you. Fell for nine. Nope. Um, the third one is going to go for Ichabod on the ground. He's advantage. That was nothing. Um, Wait, Ichabod's on the ground? Yeah, from the back. What? Uh, that was team 14 hits. Whoa! Um, yeah, because he's got enough. Yeah. So we got 26. Oh, I'm, I'm waiting to do that. Okay. Oh he's he's in in I know, I'm gonna die. do it. Uh, okay, so Is that's that 13 damage. Um, it's gonna be oh reduced God, by 11. Oh my God, my brother dead. 11? Yes. I'm gonna Two use damage. reaction, interception. Uh, I throw my shield to glance some of them. So off. you hear so I rolled a nine. Look at the wide eyes and keeping mouth. This is this bladed axe comes straight for his head. You throw throw your shield forwards and jing. So, dig deep into the stone below. It's 1d10 plus 2 and I rolled a 9. Perfect. So I'm going to, on so, the ground, I look at him with my shield up, and I was like, this is what I meant! Get out of here! <laughs> he nods furiously. Um, next up is the fourth, uh, no, no, the fifth duer, last one, um, who's going to charge past all of you guys um, and go straight for uh, you, Sam, as the caster. Uh, six. No. <laughs> so, 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 I, that hits. You, you, you jump back in the ways as, as this blade whoo, as swings past, whoo, cutting through the air. Stop. Um, <laughs> and next Stop. up is in the name of Justin Tracy. with Shiloh on deck. <laughs> okay. okay. Um, yeah, but you're not here's the thing. Um, I got Rattle Smite, so I'm not going to do that right now. What I will do is I'm going to... I'm going gonna, 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 I'm I'm gonna to take it, and there's like a and there's like an incredible like a mirage of just like tons of dirt trails stemming off her how like her halberd okay like, glint, like glints oh, no. of like glints of it and then she's gonna go in uh go in um she's gonna try and get at um flanking with someone if possible okay so you have to move around uh the only one you can really get oh no because there's a there's the door that came the fifth one that came and it was like next well, to i want to do with george to George, okay, you could get around him, but then you'd be surrounded. I'll um, be surrounded by the other side. Okay, yeah. cool, that's fine. Uh, then I'm just gonna poke. I'm just gonna poke him with it, and he has Bane. So I'm gonna see if this hits first. Yeah. T. Ah, yeah, Carbal tunnel. I almost had an 18. That was a five. So five plus. That's not. Yeah, that's. Yeah. I don't think that's gonna no. hit. Five plus five. Ten. Uh, okay, ten, ten. Then that's not it. So you, you, your, your, your spear uh, goes uh, down for it. Did you have advantage on that? I um. Because oh, you're flat flanking. Am I? No, but did you do the ten foot reach thing, or did you get within five feet of it? Oh, I can't do. I can't decide before. I was doing the ten foot reach okay. one. Uh, so, so you, 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 you were. It was a bit too far away as you, as you tried to get around and get him to do position. But you, you stab forward, and he just pff, knocks to the side. Uh, next up is uh, Ichabod with fell on deck. Ask me if that was it. What? You didn't ask me if that was it. Is that your turn? Canada's yes. <laughs> <laughs> what? No, it's what? your Sorry. Yes, yeah, so it's your turn with my It's your yeah. Yeah. That that was the not Why am I in the, uh, I don't know You are, like, in the middle of the, of the oh, main, of the, the main fray. About 20 feet away from the, from the, from the doors. Okay. Uh, but there's one guy one right in front of you who attacks Sam. Okay, uh, sorry, Sam. Uh, I'm gonna go and don't touch my brother. Uh, and I'm gonna <laughs> cast Guiding Bolts on, uh, Ooh. The guy who attacked him. Ooh. Give me advantage, please. Um, energy, energy dribbles in your fingers. A, a, a force you can Wait, build up inside of you, you that shoots through your arm and down, <coughs> like through your very vein, glowing of bright golden, and then blasting forward in bolts of energy. Uh, can you please make a tackle? Uh, fifteen to hit. It's not him, sorry. Um, so, so the the guy sees this, this this bolt of energy coming out of him. He raises his shield. To, um, and this is George, right? Yes. It's, he, he 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 knocks the beam away. Oh, I should I should have thought twice about you when you said you were magic. Guess you were stronger than I thought. Um, uh, next up is Ichabod. Ichabod's gonna uh, no. scramble back. Um, he's gonna come. Oh, he's gonna come up behind the one that attacks Sam, and and okay. try to hit him on the head with advantage. Hey. Come on. Come on. No, uh, thirteen. Um, so so what happens is he bangs against his um his helmet, and you see like a little dent in the helmet. Um, but then the the door shuts around. Goes, I'm just a boy. T turn back around and, and to to attack uh, you guys. Uh, failure up with Magnus on deck. So, Zeros is the guy's name, right? 
do whatever the George. 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 Well, I'm multi-attacking now. <laughs> nothing, nothing's stopping me from multi-attacking. What's his name? I don't care. I'm gonna kill him. <laughs> his name's Dimko. A dirty twenty and an eighteen. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. That's it. So that's nine slashing with the bite. Twelve slashing with the claws. <laughs> this guy stepped forward. 44. He asked for it. Okay. He asked for it. He took cover himself to leader. He's attacking yeah. my bro Ika. Like. He's attacking my brother. Okay, so no, no, he's than that. Uh, yeah. so so you see, he is like like there's there's giant scratches like his armor is like like fully wow. bitten into. He's bleeding from multiple wounds. <laughs> st- Staggers back, um, but um, he has has no one's approached him in his range, so he hasn't got it after he said it all yet. Um, I just wore it and I'm just I <laughs> wore it. Uh, just lay out fiercely, like spittle and blood flying from your from your throat as you as you back. Um, as, as he stumbles back. <coughs> Dirty beast! Um, Magnus, you're up with Sam on deck. Ooh, he said Dirty Beast? Yeah. <laughs> it's not usually like this, but don't call him that! <gasps> hey, uh, 24. Yeah! Oh! 24 definitely hits it. You're don't attacking this Long sword Long sword hey, against yours. I should have specified. Um, they're gonna go ahead and, yeah, I that's gonna be dead. ten slashing. Ooh. Please describe how yours falls. Um, <laughs> my blade was not made by dwarves. It was uh, not, not made by Duogard. It was made by dwarves. And superior craftsmanship. I am going to come straight down and if he Do pulls you say up, that before you kill him? <laughs> no, I don't. Um, I said, don't call him that. And I'm going to bring this down with excessive force, and it shouldn't do this, yet it does. My sword goes through his great axe into his neck. <coughs> slicing it, slicing it in half. Uh, there, there's, 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 there's a giant gash in the neck as he stumbles, bleeding, falls on knees. And then with the rest of with the rest of my turn, I'm going to like have my shield. I'm gonna have my shield above him. I'm gonna go like that as he's stumbling, and I'm gonna say, to the rest of you, this does not need to happen. Everyone can live here, but step forward if you wish to meet the same fate. Um, the dragon will kill you all. Who stands can I? To hell Damn, we killed him. the dragon. Can I for like, like, oh, never mind. <laughs> Sorry, I'm sorry, with, 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 with a thud, brutal. Uh, his, his head <laughs> clanks to the ground. Oh, that was brutal. And, he, and his heart stops pumping blood out of the neck. Yeah, I wonder. My face, okay. like, twists in disgust, and I'm going to take a step back. All right. Um, taking a step, actually, because I won't provoke any opportunity attacks, I'm going to use my movement to get within five feet of, um, if, I, if there's a place where I can be within five feet of both Shiloh and Ichabod. Uh, yeah, now that Shiloh is, now that... Uh, uh, Ichabod is back with the main uh, party that you can do that. Okay. Yeah. Next up um, is yeah. Sam with the Dorgar coming up. Uh, the one right in front of me. Um, right, like right as you missed him, you're like, yeah. you're ugly, and you can't hit anyone. <laughs> and I'm gonna cast vicious mockery. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, um, he's making a save. That's a charisma save. Yeah. No wisdom. Wisdom. Yes. Uh, eleven. I'm pretty sure that fails. Yes. Yeah. And then it's going to be 1d4 damage, and he has Dispenser as next, next attack roll. So 2 damage. Okay, just okay. attack roll, gotcha. Okay. And, and <laughs> one of it does, and does then he I'm going to flash his face really quick just to show him how it goes. <laughs> so, so you, I, I, you accompany your, your words with strums of an instrument, and this the music twists into the shape of his face. <laughs> how dare <laughs> you! I'll have you know my face is, is one of the most beautiful of all the. <laughs> No! <laughs> Decapitation. Yeah. yeah, your face is beautiful. It's about to be separated from your neck. Out uh, of next up, um, actually, we're going to resolve back. That, that one's attack first. He, 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 he roars, and he, he's going he's to try to like straight up just slice your head straight off. Disadvantage. Uh, yep. That is uh, oh. six. So, so he, 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 he totally misjudges. In fact, I think what ha- happens is he, he squeezes his axe up, and it, it passes through the illusion of his face, and he, and he just... Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh. I would never transform into you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what are you talking about? Yeah, what are you talking uh, about? Next up, where are the yeah, rest of I'm our? Are the rest of the people behind us? And I can't. Oh yeah, you're behind us. Yeah. Okay. So, so at any point, we could drop back. 
Yeah. Okay. All right. So um, next up, we're gonna do we're do the rest of the four. Uh, uh, Dugar. Uh, um, I bl- who's at the front line right now? Everyone. You and you and you. you I'm also it. trying to hide behind him. A little. <laughs> I am large. Okay. I think all four oh, are gonna attack you. Bad, let's go. Yeah, you're, all the, right. you're the bear. Twenty-one. Yellow attack. Twenty-one hits. Seven. That doesn't hit. Oh. Eight. Doesn't hit. Uh, Twenty-one, but bang. Oh. I, I have eleven AC. Oh, okay. okay. Um. So, so, so two, two of those hits. Yeah. Um. Oh. What is bang? Minus eleven minus damage. Uh-huh. Plus is the opposite. Seven plus damage. Okay. Slashing fridge. Okay. God, Druids. <laughs> <laughs> oh. The problem you is, did. life is touch range. Wizard. Yeah, but you can touch. Oh no! Okay. Okay. Next up is Elena yeah. with Shiloh and Beck. I said that. Nice. Right. Right. Um, yeah. I am gonna, I'm gonna pick whoever's closest to the mouth <laughs> of Fell, <laughs> and I'm, I'm still behind him. I'm just gonna go <clears throat> ten foot. Let's go. Uh, wait, so if you're behind the one that's... Oh, he's, yes, gotcha. Okay, uh, so... I'm using him like a... Bad. Yeah, so roll hit with advantage. Uh, with advantage? Because yeah, he's really wanted to. Oh, oh, you're using 10-foot. I'm, I'm using the 10-foot. Okay, so then we'll, we'll know that. Ooh. 17 plus 5. 20, 22. Okay, um, roll the damage. Uh, what? Is it the Bane one? Oh, uh, no, uh, no. no not this right. one's not Bane? Okay, cool. Okay, so, roll a... Uh, this is a this is a DC thirteen roll a wisdom saving throw. Uh, six. You uh that Druagar is now frightened until the end of this turn. Oh gosh. Okay. <laughs> Wait until uh until wow. the spell ends, which is uh eight, eight turns. turns. Eight okay. Turns. Okay. Sure. And then. Oh my. Damn. Eighteen. Eighteen. Okay. Eight, eighteen and for eighteen damage. Eighteen damage. So so you this I is love so yes. much. Two. Straight to it, to his back. He still was, uh, <coughs> coughs up blood. As he, what he sees behind me is that illusion, and my, I don't have my fo- fo- fox max on him right now. Mm-hmm. So her, her like, her eyes bloom outwards into like thousands of trails, as like, like just, ev- just like every single trade route, every single sea route in Aeth- A- um, Aethica is Aether. beholden Aether. to him. Behold. Geography! Oh, his eyes are yeah. 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 widened. He looks around. Be not oh, he's American! He can't no, understand! Be a <laughs> <laughs> Europe is a uh, club! Next up um, is <laughs> Shiloh with Ichabod on deck. You just said Europe is a club. Where is my brother in the midst of so many? Ichabod on deck is a So there, there's, a, there's the main force of the party, there's one, um, there's one uh, Dorgar, and then there's uh, the Ichabod. So, would you say that we're ready to like, attack him? Uh, is he like... Basically, is he like? She's so the actually no. No one is preparing to attack him right now. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go to him and I'm gonna go stand back, be careful. I'm gonna touch him. I'm gonna cast light on him. So that is he glowing? So can you that, uh, can you make cast light on a person? No, no it's on his clothes, right? Uh, yeah. Okay. You can touch one object that is no larger than ten feet in dimension. So his clothes can count or whatever. Mm. Um, so, <laughs> so there's gonna be bright light in a twenty foot radius. Oh, 20 feet. the corridor. That's crazy. The entire corridor. So they have and since the light can be colored, I'm gonna make it look bright white. <laughs> they have disadvantage on. Yeah, but that, that was, was the plan, man. All right, that's that's the plan. Plan. I have a nat twenty on knowing Dorgar. That's a good cantrip right and now. For my bonus action, I'm just gonna you know do some sorcery points. Okay. And Shiloh. Um, <laughs> next up is uh, Ichabod. Um, it, support caster. Oh, um, what challenge does it do? Support caster. What, what, what challenge does it do? Oh, uh, bonus action, just uh, sorcery points. Okay. Uh, so, so Hagabot, uh, he's he's going right now. Uh, take, take. I'm right here. I'm no. gonna stay by him. Yes. Okay. What did you tell Ichabod to do? Yeah. Uh, God, stay with me. <laughs> be careful. Right. Okay. You know he's, like, crowd he's, he's gonna try, try to just, just swing wildly at the, uh, the door in front of him. Um, it's just in fear to this. You know, there's this. Lucky? 15. Oh. oh. Almost. One he hit, away. He, he hit oh, exactly so he where he straight up hit a 15. What? Did he just straight up hit a 15? Like, you rolled a 15? No, he rolled a, he rolled a 14 and oh, plus, plus one. one. I like to yeah. imagine he hit exactly what where I taught him, stats? but there's armor there. <laughs> Wait, is he using a dagger or a hand axe? Uh, no, he's using a club. Well, oh, yeah. so strength. Okay. Yeah. Um, okay. So. Yeah, you should add a six care. You should add a six. Car- like member of the pro- Mari should be the sixth character <laughs> and just play Ichabod. Do you want to play? Do you want to be my brother? Do you want to play Ichabod? Do you want to be my brother? 
You guys go. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, so next up is Fel with Magnus on deck. Do I have advantage on the guy that's frightened? He, uh, no, it's only... It, Ooh, no. It, frightened it, just, just frightened just you, means... You, you can't move towards it, and you have you have disadvantage on attack rolls against the source of your fear. Oh, so I have nothing happening. Okay, then. This but guy looks weak, I did right? do 18 damage. Yeah. <laughs> then for my first multi-attack, I'm going to bite and see what happens. Does a 17 hit? 17 hits? That's, um... That's 11 uh, piercing. Does he die? Yeah. I, chop, <laughs> I just bite his arm off. Ah! Ah! Convulsions as he thrashes on the ground, blood f- f- flowing out, like pull, pulls out of his arm. Like, yeah. like, <laughs> Remember, kids, losing a limb can mean death. <laughs> yeah, and then for my second, is there another? Dr- Get him to the doctor. Oh, wait, me? there's no doctors. <laughs> is, is, is there another one near me? No, no, uh, yeah, there, there are three near. Uh, three near you right now. Yeah. Which one's the doctor? I, I'm gonna tap the one that actually like, doctor as well. Uh, okay, yeah. And I'm just gonna stand back on my hind legs, hold my claws up, and just come down here. Does it 18 hit? 18 hits. Cool. Over damage. That's uh. Seven. I don't know why that didn't So, so you, you, your claws come down, you like I think with one with one paw, you bat his shield out of the way and then clash across his face. Uh seven damage? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh so he his oh, his his, his bad, like a big bad. like <laughs> like big scratches of, of claw marks Shut right into, into the metal of, of his of his face plate. Uh, he's spitting up blood to the side. Um next up is uh Magnus with Sam on deck. I'm going to step up into the hallway, First so it's three across, yes, yeah. I'm going to be in the middle, so then it's reach and whatnot. So there's a bear in front of me, and behind yeah. the bear is Elena, and then around. No, 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 behind, there's a bear, and then a Dwargar, and then, and, 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 then, and then Elena. Cause like, no, 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 I'm behind the bear. I'm using the ten foot to reach around. <laughs> you have a high AC, please st- stand gotcha. next to me. <laughs> okay. That, I, I'm Speaking saying, yes. of high AC, I'm going to step up to the Dwargar that... Where the where the duogar just lost an arm facing yeah. the other one? Actually, is there a place where I can be like? No, there isn't. I'm gonna step up to a duogar. Um, hopefully, no. We'll just. I'm just gonna hit him. <laughs> so I'm gonna look at him and it's like, will you stop attacking my friend? Um, I think it's kill his friend. So. Intimidation with advantage. Let's say t- uh, 18. 18 succeeds. No, it's yeah, it is an 18. Um, it's <laughs> fine. fine. <laughs> Put the Person back where they came from. I, I do live. <laughs> Let the innocents go, and we all live. Uh, fine. Uh, he, 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 he turns it and, and starts running away. Clunk, 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 clunk. His, his armor. Opportunity uh, attack. No. <laughs> I want an opportunity attack. Him. You all you have to. Yeah, I want. Oh, opportunity attack. Yeah, I'm reacting. Uh, okay. Yeah, no. make, make your opportunity attacks. Oh my gosh. Oh, I, I can. I guess I'm gonna do oh, one. Yeah, go Twenty-one. Oh and my god. Uh, does a 14 hit? No, 14 does not hit. So you, you, you swing your, your pot make a, and... Make a save. Wisdom. Oh, <laughs> a disadvantage. Uh, too, disadvantage? Uh, Magnus, good looking out. Uh, that's, uh, 19. Uh, succeeds. Oh. He doesn't have the, uh, what's it called? Uh, that's okay. Wait, did you hit him? That's, no, that's right here, there. so... Okay. I swiped him. Uh, 10, yeah. Is that a plus okay. So, so, so as he's fleeing away, you stab in the leg. He trips, ah, oh, to the ground, clawing away. Stands back up, starts limping away, leaving a trail of blood, dragging one useless leg behind him. I want to kill this guy. We'll so find bad. him later. Uh, just, okay. The, there's ahead. still a crowd of Duogar, right? Uh, yeah. Um, well, I mean, there, I didn't there's, even there's exactly three Duogar. <laughs> there's exactly three. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to yell. Well, there, there's more in the armory, but I, but I thought the, there were. There's, no, 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 no. there's two facing you, and then one near Sh- Sh- Shiloh and I- Ichabod. The one he said, uh, "You're hairless" or some shit. Or yeah, some yeah, shit. that one. Oh, okay. The one you vicious mockery. I'm gonna, I'm gonna step forward another step, and I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna say, all of you have a choice to stop this, and I'm gonna take a ready action for the next one that goes to attack Fell. Um, I'm okay. gonna take a swing at him. All right. Uh, they're gonna look at that. They, they're. They're at war with us. I didn't expect it to work. Yeah. Um, neither did I. <laughs> um, the, 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 two, the, two, the two that... Actually, hold on. Roll by individual people. I did um, kill the leader, but... Wow, okay. So the, the two that you guys are facing, the one that's not near uh, Ichabod and, and Shiloh, um, they're they their axe. Uh, no, no, please, please, go. We... 
Fine. Just fine. And they, they, they turn clicking off after their friend, uh, who they catch up with and are, are helping along. Um, the dragon. My. We should have come up. Well, I can't. Uh, no. Yeah. Okay, so the last one. Uh, there's one more. Yeah, we're gonna tell the um, dragon. That's what. Yeah, exactly. Who, gotta leave no prisoners. Okay, he's gonna talk to you one more time. Don't worry about it. Xavier's turn. He's ready his action. Um, and took a ready action. Yeah. If anybody goes to, if anybody attacks my allies, yeah. I mean, there's um, one next and to you. Do I go before? Him? If he attacks Shiloh, I'm gonna yeah, hit him. Like, I gave them all a choice. Door. Sorry, yes, you're right. It is. Oh, it's Sam and Dora. Um, I promise my shield to you. Yeah. I'm going to. Yeah, I can't draw my sword because I need action. But I'm going. Draw to... Drawing weapons bonus action. Oh. Dr- well. If you're making an attack, drawing one weapon can be part of that attack. Yeah. Free action to do another one would take your full action. Do you? Are you? Are you making an attack and like drawing your rapier out? Yeah. Want to then so, you can do that for free. Oh, okay. You get you get a f- free action. To okay. Sure. As I do that, I'm gonna say the bonus um, action one is to curb fighters. You have been fast, but intelligence has always outran you. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> Good lord. Okay. <laughs> that's that's a that's a four of wisdom save. Uh more for damage. Two damage, disadvantage. That's so good. And so he, he he's fuming right now. He she she holds out it, rips it off, throws it to the side. I will not be beaten by the likes of you! Me? Uh he he swings oh, forward again. What? Ooh. <laughs> Uh, 20, 21 to hit. Oh, man. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Dang it, that hit <laughs> Uh, that's 14 damage. Oh, oh, okay. I, did he attack my ally? Yeah, yes. Is he too far away from me to hit him? Yes. Yeah, sorry. Okay. You, you, you went to the two. The oh, ninja, you were close enough to. Uh, Dang, ouch. That's why you always have a hand, a hand bow. Are you okay. down? Oh yeah. I have a. Hand yeah. Bow. So so you. He, 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 he brings his his axe. You try to dodge out of the way, but it hits you in the chest. You pff, oh, there's a big cut down your center. And you pff, tumble to the ground, spilling blood. You're barely making no. dodges. <coughs> um. Next up <laughs> is uh, Elena, <laughs> Elena with Shiloh on deck. There's one more Durgar. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna run over, try to get uh, advantage with Shiloh, right? Against because he's right next to Shiloh. Uh, yes. Okay. I'm gonna try and get Shiloh. advantage with Shiloh, uh, and then I'm just gonna smack him. Okay. Roll hit. My God. Thirteen. Thirteen's not a hit. Ew! So, what so, the so heck? You're charging forward and trying to keep track of all the allies and then make sure that these don't come back. You <clears> look <throat> back just in time to see your attack whiff uh, pat past him. Um, he, he, there's, this door is roaring. He has fury in his eyes <laughs> and from this constant verbal assault. Um, Shiloh, you're up. Uh, I'm gonna see you unconscious on the ground and then just like, <laughs> <laughs> You, uh, um, you He's faking his injury. Oh, Shiloh, so don't worry about him. I have him. I'm very dead. He's <laughs> through the stars above. Uh, do I have an attack with advantage because I'm being frightened? Not with spell attacks, only melee attacks. I'm gonna try a guiding bolt again. Okay. Guaranteed crit. You, make sure you're not. Make sure you're not within five. Miss. Okay. So if you're you, within five feet, you, you, you pull the magic into your hands, blasting it forward one more time uh, with with with, with an attack that, but he, the, the dwarf uh, ducks under it and splashes against the wall, throwing light in all directions. Um. Okay. Next up is. I'm so um, glad the light effect is up and just like. It could with fell on, oh, with Ichabod fell on did, he hit, did he still hit him with disadvantage? Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. Because you're gonna have this version of Vision Bucket anyway. Okay. Uh, okay, so next okay. up, okay, so Ichabod. We're just debuffing these guys. <laughs> Debuff party. Ichabod's gonna attack have. one more time. I reduce damage. Club. You cast light. <sighs> you do vicious mind. Oh no, he's advantage. He's advantage against it. He's 20. He's a child. How is he? He's not a child. He's like Wait, 20. 19. Um, yeah. I'll so he, Okay. Oh, takes his breath. Looks to, looks to you, Magnus. Alright. <laughs> Cracks his uh, the, the club against the, the side of the neck of the Dorgar, uh, rolling for damage, which is a 1d4 plus 1. It's only a club, Our so that's clubs d6 or no? Clubs are d4. Clubs are d4 for that. I think know. bats can count as a d6. Uh, that's gonna be 2 damage. Nice. <laughs> you, yeah. If you, <coughs> it's like a child! Um. That's what I keep I saying. Okay, um, oh, 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 Bell is oh. up with Magnus on deck. So for my bonus action, I'm gonna heal myself with a spell slot. So I gain five hit points. Okay. Oh, cool. And then I'm gonna charge the guy. So so you you pull you pull energy into your body. You, you, there's like a ripple of strength. The muscles bulge in. You you, you, you 
re recover yourself, and they charge forward, roaring, spit, spittle, and blood pouring from your mouth. So does a 24 hit? <laughs> yes, a 24 hits. No, 12 12 hits. 12 not hit. Mm. So roll for damage? 12 damage. Okay. So he, he looks horrible. Was this the, the jaw or the, the claw? It's the bite. The bite. Ah, down on the, on the back of his shoulder, uh, crunching through one of the shoulder plates. Ah, he starts throwing you off. He's, you're just, he's, tra you're, he's trapped in your... Um, in, in your in your jaws rips out tearing flesh and metal as he as giant scars and scrapes the his body. <sighs> um then I roar in his face if you measure him. Okay. Magnus, you're up. Sam you're on deck. The door looks That's preoccupied sick. with the bear, not the bar, right? Oh uh, no, he is fully focused on Sam right now. Oh, I pissed him oh off. he's fully focused on Sam. Okay, yeah. good. I'm gonna call good. out I'm gonna call out to Ichabod <laughs> Good work. Time to, <laughs> good work. It is time to practice a tactical withdrawal. <laughs> um, I'm going to Thank run you. down. I'm gonna run down the corridor towards where the junction is, and I'm gonna see is there like, is there some sort of shield wall waiting for us, or does it seem like we so, have driven... so? So you're going through into the armory. Um. Oh wait, sorry. So we there was the junction we were in. Yes. We oh, went down the hallway. Returning. They chased us, and that's where Jors was from, right? Yeah. Okay. And we just cleared them out, and the rest of them broke ranks and fled. Yes. Um, so so you, you go into the, in the main hallway again, pu pulling a combat after you. Is the army behind us? The army is always behind you, yeah. Okay, and the, behind us is also a small army of emaciated swords. Yeah. Um, so the 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 hallway actually is pretty empty. There are there doors from both sides, but they're going down hallways. They're all like seemingly funneling towards the armory, uh, the, from which the sounds of combat are getting louder and louder. Do um, we have, like, do we have um, some sort of path that is clear at the moment? You can get to the exit. Um, it, it's, it seems that Dwarvar have been pulled from all, all, like, layers of the mountain, just charges Arbor to keep the prisoners there. Okay. Um, so there's no... But they're not, they're not cutting off the escape route, except for the, the obvious path where the prisoners might go. So they're keeping us from attacking their city? They're not necessarily keeping us from they're, fleeing? They don't have the resources to, def to defend the exit, they only have the resources to just fight the combat going on within the armory. I see. Mm -hmm. So we can withdraw from the armory and move forward, but yes. only if we do so now. Right. Okay. Then I'm going to go ahead and issue with like a voice of command, <sighs> just forward advance, basically, <laughs> try to get the swordsmen <laughs> behind us to, um, with. I mean, I don't know if anybody's setting up a rear guard, but sure. to advance and get out of here. As you fast you, you as see a couple. You have a couple of soldiers break through the lines, carrying like like one has a like, super intricate shield and, and, and a dagger. Um, <laughs> They're just getting <laughs> out at the shiniest weapons. It's like we found the oh, one, 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 one has a helmet and a giant and a giant spear. Um, and they, turn, <laughs> they, they break through the ranks and they start calling their friends, bringing forward a rank of. Uh, Who's in command here? <laughs> like, they killed all. They killed. They killed all the commanders. Then I am. Make for that exit, and I'm gonna. Sure. I'm uh, gonna run, and I'm gonna see if I can set up a rear guard for. Okay. Control. Yeah, sure. Um, make uh, make a charisma check. That is a one. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Damn. Okay. So I, I think in the, the chaos. Can battle, I? Can uh, I? Uh, situation advantage. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna move okay. on to Sam's turn. <laughs> <laughs> and come back to this. <laughs> we'll do realize what's going on with that with them. So what are you doing? Oh. I imagine that that one is them being like, oh, yes, this right. Uh, okay, so that's one player. Oh, and then I'm gonna get, like, everyone is excited from. <laughs> no way we're gonna get a fucking character death already, dude. Okay, uh, dude, you just revealed this backstory. Next up is the last one. Yeah, that, that's like. Uh, it's your pro. This is... Okay, so he's he's gonna keep acting really fast. 23. <laughs> uh, Mark, why didn't you check your hand or something? You have a hand axe, right? Um, I, just, I use my action to dash. I'm trying to get as far back. Oh, as okay. okay, next up um, is going to be Elena with Shiloh. Wait, wait, hold up. When I'm running back, I don't happen to run by that, do I? Hold on, this was a luck check. I'll show the audience okay. one sec. Oh. That's a luck check. What do you mean? What? Luck check. Luck check Sometimes for plot important events, I roll luck checks for background NPCs or events. Uh, okay. oh, this was important. Samuel's alive! That's alive. <laughs> was that a good roll or a bad roll? Okay. Wait, so is he unconscious now? Uh, uh he, I'm old, he's almost dead. Yeah, he's, you, 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 How many fails? You have a giant, like, axe stuck in you your chest. Two fails? Well, I got hit. And so, I okay. So, Elena, you're up. What do you want to do? Uh, oh. I rub my hand, I rub my hands together really quickly. <laughs> oh, you're actually dead. Boom! <laughs> uh, and I bring, and I use all my lay of hands to bring you back up to four health. <laughs> Wait, you have ten? I have ten. You should be dead. <laughs> I'm gonna stay back up. Ha! 
Told you. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> oh wow. Okay. I um, may I might have a bonus action, so hold on, give me a second. I want to know your something. abilities in advance. Fool. Well, while you're checking that, Shiloh, let's take a try. Oh, damn. Go first, high charm. Okay, roll it. Uh, Fourteen. Uh, this, so this this guy, this Durgar, with this gray skin, his eyes flaming the rage, b- dodge out of the way, b- bats the um, uh, bats the yours. Uh, oh, it's not a care shield, so it's a buckler, not a shield. But he, he blocks all that bu- uh, buckler, roars toward, towards you, his beard flying in all directions. Yeah, yeah. Um, Ichabod, you have, you have your bonus action? Nope, okay. bonus action. I- I- Ichabod yeah. um, is going is, is with you. Oh. Um, oh, he's with me running to the rear. You, you, you pulled him away with you, yeah. Oh, cool. Uh, failure up. Cool. Uh, I'm just going to maul this guy. You okay. have advantage dogs, I'm up. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, goodbye. Advantage oh, the, this is the... Sorry, never mind. It's unrelated. Um, oh. d- doesn't matter now. Okay, Uh-oh. go. Uh oh. Uh oh. check failed. This is the bite. Hey, does a 21 hit? Yes. Cool. I think he's good. And does a 15 hit? Oh. Uh, 15 does not hit. Okay, well, this is the bite. The bite really works. Oh, oh. nice. That's 11 piercing. Alright, describe how he goes down. <laughs> <Hey>. <laughs> I'm just gonna munch his face off. <laughs> He's like, oh, I will not be patient down. I will stand strong Fair. in the face of. <laughs> <laughs> and with the thickening crunch, you feel the bones oh. of his of his head break Gross. around and crunch under your jaws. Oh, Great <laughs> blood <laughs> spurting out of the between your teeth. With my forty feet of movement, I'm gonna run to help Magnus in the rear guard. Okay. Uh, this, so the battle's still going on, but the, there's more and more soldiers breaking out from the, but, 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 but through the crowd. Um, Advance! Okay, so you, Get out so of you here. rolled a nat one with your charisma check to, to rally the forces, right? Um, I rolled a nat one with Can those two help? guys. Was this... Okay. Was this, um, wait, is this me... Is, was that nat one for me rallying as I run through them? That was intended, yes. Uh, so I like to imagine that now one is like, who does this guy think he is? I, I think actually what's happening is that these soldiers are so focused on getting to the armory that they're, they're like so focused, they're pushing past you, like you're you're screaming out, but you're not one of their commanders, they don't recognize you, they're not following uh, orders. Um, I got an idea, don't worry. Um, okay. Suddenly, um, from... So don't you, the dragon. <laughs> the dragon uh, appears. Char- charging out of... Uh, at, 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 from the front um, of the line is is a figure who is put uh, hastily uh, like uh, strapped on a, br- a breastplate. Um, he has a a, a uh, half helm, half him on, and two a sword in each hand. Um, the the shaggy beard of of Samuel, uh, who's, who's running out, <laughs> out of the front line. Um, no, for a second you said that, and I'm like, missed. <laughs> what? Is no, he no, no. Us? These, these are normal long swords. Okay, good. Um, good. He's still dual wielding long swords. There's two. Yeah, long oh, swords are versatile. So oh, he's he crazy. He's got insane. <laughs> There's uh, two. <laughs> this guy spent so long donning a breastplate, but I'm not gonna complain about it. He, he, he has to put on a breastplate. He just kind of put it on, like it's not strapped on or anything. <laughs> but it's, it, the flaps are dangling out. But but he's he's rolling along with soldiers, uh, carrying them on. And with that nat twenty that I, I, I rolled earlier, um, he's oh. uh, he's leading a big charge, breaking through the the, the door guard line and charging forward. Sam, are you all right? And just, I'm just like boogieing everywhere. <laughs> okay, well let's up. Charge forward. We're making the exit now. I know it. I broke him up. Are you brothers? You can't see his face. You see oh, face I can't right? see his face. Yeah. Okay, so then I don't do that. Yeah, okay. so I'm just trying to... I'm running to see if I can fight with a rear guard. Uh, I'm, yeah. I um, doing so, uh, I, I think um, with this, we're, we're going to kind of break out of initiative. And you guys are charging uh, through among this little line of soldiers. It's breaking through. You poof, 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 out of the way. Can I use my last part of inspiration to, like, inspire? Yeah, roll for it. Group? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Blaze a victory mark. Yes. <laughs> that twenty. No! no! <laughs> Put that in that counter. Oh wow. Oh wow. <laughs> so with a burst and a flare of victorious music. Oh, that's so you, cool. You, you, Sam and Samuel lead the charge um, out, out of um, a, towards the exit, uh, towing a train of, of weakened soldiers he after playing. you. Boom! 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 Um, really towards the exit, breaking out. You see a light up ahead. The door guard are, are, are falling behind. With the, 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 you hear the clanking on this ba- of fights behind you. Short legs. <laughs> oh, one of them just explodes. <laughs> 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 Do you want to ride me? Get on top of me. Ooh. You don't happen to have thaumaturgy, do you? Nope. Um, you can but, play your cool guitar rip on top of a bear. <laughs> yeah. Is are are any of them slowing down? 
Uh, yes, but, the, but, but with this, this big wave, you break out into the open. I'm trying to help the slowest one just, like, just um, pushing them forward. <laughs> yeah. I'm in. Uh, so, the Duogar are fighting the rear end of this train. Wait, sorry. Um, yes, oh, and, and then they're being be pushed push back. Yeah, then, push I'm, push back then I'm in the back using interception to protect people and just continuing to withdraw. That's a reaction I can do. Absolutely, yeah. So so you're, you're bat- batting the door away with your, your shield. They're, they're, they're screaming obscenities after you as as, as you lock away, holding the defense as the line of, of shield wall at the end of the, the train uh, uh, protects the rest of the soldiers as they break out into the sunlight and start running down the gravel path to the foot of the mountain. Finally, seen sunlight in what may have been months. Wow! Yay! <laughs> Not for prison break. Yay! That's a fun. We did. God, uh, I killed. Uh, so is there like a? Is there like a just so a winding bunch of trails everywhere? Or nice. uh, do we know? Do we know where to go to just like go right towards our? Uh, you go towards uh, Aetherium. Cart. Cart. Oh, your cart. Your cart was left outside. So it, <laughs> it, it was. So using the the path that you. Entered, you left right outside. It got your car. Do I get to pass the goblins? Uh, the goblins seem to have all, or they're all gone. Oh. <laughs> the uh, goblins are not fighting a <laughs> small <laughs> army. Are we out of combat? Uh, yes, you're all out of combat. Where is my brother? Is he hurt? Uh, he's uh, he's like limping along. He's out, out of breath. <gasps> I uh, pick him up. Was he? I pick him up. No. Oh, okay. um, he was going to pick him up. Please don't be totally totally Princess Carrie. He wasn't. He yeah, wasn't. He wasn't. Yeah. He took yeah, oh damage. my god! What happened? Sure, I print it. I'm Princess carrying Ichabod. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, like got, watch. It, it's actually <laughs> a, a sign of, of how like like scared he was that he's not complaining at all that you're just carrying him. Ichabod. Shiloh. Oh. I I see. What just happened? I run over. Adventure happened. Okay. Okay. Oh my god. You're hurt. Yes. You almost died today. Yeah. Congratulations, it's the first one. Don't congratulate this! That was a joke. I Not a funny joke! <laughs> uh. <laughs> uh. Did we make it outside the... Uh, yeah, yeah. We're out, uh, you're we're all... The, 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 there's a, a shout of cheers as they finally break out into the sunlight. I'm gonna give him a hug and I cast healing word. You're gonna deep <gasps> <hug>? Yeah. <sighs> Energy flows into him. Uh, the healing is... In uh, his four points oh. Hey, thank you. You hit him for four? No. no, no. <laughs> <laughs> Kaden, uh, Magnus is just gonna sit in... Yeah. I'm gonna tackle Samuel. <laughs> I think that the Drugar are actually like at the line of shadow where the light hits down. It is like, is about high noon at the moment, and the, the light goes straight down to the entrance of the cave, but there's just a large crowd of them staring menacingly out in the shadows. I'm gonna copy you and also tackle Samuel. <laughs> but, but finally, you see one, one lone goblin in makeshift armor drive to the front. And if you, if you look closely, you might see a single tear right now his eyes. He salutes you. And then he disappears into the crowd of Durgar as they retreat into the cave. Uh, Sam just got tackled by me and a horny pal bear. <laughs> no, I, I, I deep bothered. Oh, okay. Oh. And henceforth, he was known as Sir Googler. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, so, so I didn't know there was so much connection between you two. <laughs> it so, will be bonded. <laughs> so, so Sam, uh, he, he's finally out. He tosses his helmet aside. Um, and, oh. um, Words cannot express how much I've, I've, I've hoped for this moment. It's been a while. It has. Is what this, have you been up moment? to? Yeah, he just took his helmet off. Are you two brothers? In yeah. a way. Oh, that's so wonderful. I have a question. So yeah. I've been to the Fey realm. At this yeah. point, you do have I, do mm. I get any sense from him? Because they could Fae. be twins. Make it our. Make an arcana check. I did. Yeah, five. that wasn't. He's four. Five. Yeah, very. Good about the twins. Parents. It look very similar. Sleep at all. Very nice. Very <laughs> um, what have you been up to all this time? Just adventuring here and there. I heard uh, heard word that you were in High Loft, so I was making my way there when I met these people. It's well, so nice to meet you. I'm Shiloh. Samuel. <laughs> I am the spider, and the bear. Huh. We don't have, we don't see many shapeshifters here. <laughs> what the? <laughs> it's. I'm. I must say I'm very grateful. It's without you, without your help, I'm not sure how much longer we would have lasted. Well, we're very glad that we came here at this time. So, so are we. <laughs> I can't. Oh, it's been so long since I've seen the sun. I pat him on the oh, back. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> 
Where, where are you? Where are you two? Where are you? Uh, what brings you to this place? We were looking for <clears throat> something called the Shifter's Veil. Oh, she messed up in that business, huh? You know this? I have, I've gotten rations and bandages from the cart after <clears throat> I like the central. The, the, the entire soldiers are. I mean, you, you've packed quite a few rations. Yeah, I like <laughs> I like point out and try to organize it. Like, just steal our stuff. Go ahead. <laughs> They're like ravenously devouring. I like opening cans. <laughs> Absolutely. Cans. Uh, like, more more food, right? snacks of dried food. Okay. Um, but yes. Yeah, oh, does um, anyone want elk meat? <laughs> I thought I've got deer meat over here. So venison. Got a bit of yak. Ah, <sighs> it's. Sure. Uh, Shifter's Veil. That's that's been the dragon's singular quest for, well, we don't know how long. Well, part of our quest was to see if we can gather information, but it's been, you know, an acting order if, to, if we ever find any to report it immediately to Justin. And did you find any? Never did. We, we, we took out a whole encampment, but no mention of this veil or any mention of how to find it. Did you go down? Sorry, what was that? Did you go down underneath, further to the forge? Oh, no. We were captured on the, on the way back to High Loft, and the Duergar took ours in. It was obviously safe for <clears throat> passing by here, but we thought they were neutral. Seems I changed quite recently. <sighs> if this were Shifter's Veil, then the dragon would already have it. Certainly. At least we did not. This was a wild goose chase, but at least we did find a golden egg. I don't suppose. Yeah, you found people. You, I don't suppose you found we any. Did find people. It's the, just uh, a metaphor. Any other information about Shifter's Veil? Vale? That sent you down this quest. Only a little I, I hand him the page that got ripped out of the book. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, let me. Do, do you remember what that says? Uh, not word for word, but... Away, away, the gods and fey drove oblivion to a peak. Upon its top, they built a forge and decreed that none should seek. The veil of shifters hid forever, a step to worlds beyond. But darkness lies inside that forge, encased in metal strong. With jewel of heart and blood of stone, or relic lost to time, that forge might burn dark flames once more, for power lurks inside. He Samuel scans this page. His eye, his brows furrow. Uh, it's a very grim lullaby, isn't it? I wouldn't read this in my children. No. <laughs> you have to blood of stone. Who does? <laughs> We've been apart for a while. There's a lot of things you don't know about me. Oh, how wonderful! <laughs> blood of stone. Do you have another goose chase for us? You ever heard of the metal alloy? And with that, that brings an end to tonight's session. Uh, I want to thank all of you watchers at home uh, for making this possible, for, for providing your support and, and typing in the chat. Um, thank you to your players, thank you to Mari, and thank you most Thanks, sincerely Mari. to the viewers at home. I hope you have a wonderful night. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Three natural.